You know, I've never been to Arcadia before. Yeah, well, it's going to be a good time. Hello everyone and welcome. We are the Smoky Dragons. We are Trapper Judge for Carlos and today is Legend of Arcadia, episode 49. 49 episodes. And if you don't count the the two charity one shots, as uh, technically 51 episodes of main campaign content. So hope everybody's excited for what we've got here today. Hold on. It has been a little bit. Since we last played. And also, look who decided to show up. Gonna show up. She just isn't usually late. Fashionably late, of course. This is the part where we all lean our heads back and laugh. <laughs> Man, throw our heads back and laugh. I'll throw our heads back and laugh. Can't even get the meme right. No, you Sorry. throw it back. Uh, <laughs> throw it back. Always throw it back. No. No one hears a paladin, so. No. Well, not currently. The oath of throwing it back. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Continue. Oh, oh I shall. <laughs> no, strong. Mm-hmm. Are those the Korean barbecue? No. No, they're truffle oil. And oh. Truffle oil and sea salt. It's truffle shuffle oil. Truffle shuffle oil. Mm. So, go ahead and get in the recap of what happened last time. Last we left our heroes, they were unwillingly teleported to Solaris by uh, by the great magic man Warico. The one and only. Why did it sign me out? I hate you. <laughs> well, maybe that's why. You said you hate it. Give it some love. And finding themselves in the rolling hills, they met with a small creature that they came to know as a gold kobold named Arnold. Who led them to the golden city of Dinas Ur in gold dragon territory on the landmass of Almalgul? How dare you? Why every time like I this? put my phone you on this every time you've been here for like two hours. I've been here for an yeah. hour and I still forgot to do that. I'd be late, yeah, but at least I remember to put my shit on. I always do when I like that. It's every time. Fail. It really is. <laughs> You'd think I'd learn. No, it was one time I reminded you, I think. You did? Before, and then, before and then, it went out. And then he still didn't. Yeah, did. No, he did it. Oh, he did. I reminded yeah. him before anything, and I was like, It took it forever forget. for me to get him to put his phone on ring. <laughs> that's why the stupid bitch never answered because he can't stop his phone. <laughs> yeah, so that's why I'm not always on ring now. It's so blame her. I still blame you. Uh, yeah. So after uh, meeting with King Glondwin uh, of the Gold Dragons, and they also met a Gold Dragonborn named Ruzir, they figured out a little bit of what's going on in Solaris. Not too much, but even though the, the Gold Dragons haven't seen mortals uh, in quite some time, but they... Our heroes were on a quest looking for a few people. Oscar looking for Raven. 
and the rest of the group looking for uh, their halfling friend, Joras Onam. Well, mostly Redmane, Oscar, Redmane and Oscar. Those are the only ones who knew him. Everybody else uh, didn't really get a chance to I'm know him. I'm just here for, I'm along for the ride. Bobby's along for the ride. Ditto. And trying to figure out uh, what's really going on in Solaris. And Ruzier was tasked with accompanying them and accompany them he did to uh, the Amethyst realm of Cluene, to Kaaskud Castle, where they spoke with Amethelia, the queen of the Amethyst dragons. Now, um, for those of you who are just watching main campaign episodes, and for main campaign people as well, I got a couple things mixed up because okay. it, had been, it had been months since these past things. Uh, so the metallic dragons uh, worship Keln, or they used to worship Keln, god of hatred, and the gem dragons used to worship Shivala. So I had, I had accidentally swapped that. And also, Amethelia was supposed to have a French accent, and I forgot that I even did that, because it was months ago. How could you? Practice your French accent for a... for a... Uh, Call of Cthulhu, you know, you, you wanted to bust it out again? Yeah. How, how could you? How could you forget? Uh, it's because it was, it how, was how, months how, how between you, recording. How could you forget between the other millions of things that you have to remember? <laughs> I mean, yeah, you know. Your 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 GM status has been demoted from S to A plus. <laughs> <laughs> Why was it S tier? Holy shit! Wow. You know what the S stands for, right? Shit. Suck. <laughs> shitty. Uh, shitty. Big suck tier. Yes, absolutely. All of the above. Now I'm awful plus. <laughs> Awfully. Yes. So after speaking with um, with Amethelia, um, they found out uh, a little bit more information, and she directed them towards Mianuk, specifically the city of Kalkul, where the Great Library is housed in the Sapphire Dragon Realm. Uh while the uh, Amethyst realm is crumbling around them, she sends them off to learn more about what is going on. And as they teleport through, that is where we return to Legend of Arcadia. Of course, Oscar also uh, learning more about... Uh, about Raven and these other mortals that were here, as well as Captain Green Eye through uh, communing with Phoenixia, um, realizes that these people are lost. And they are also expected to best a 2,000 year old uh, warrior who is a servant of Genesis. And all they know is that his name is Adelgrim. Sounds easy. Oh, that was his name? I couldn't remember over the <laughs> eight different names he had. Uh, Quish, no, this group does not have an official name. They, they We've opted to not have one. They opted to not have one. <laughs> because the group's, the members keep changing. Not, the members do keep changing. We're not pirates. It's so Oscar's name. obligatory is, party. Because, oh, hey, it's... Those guys. Whoever stays. We're Oscar and the Misfits. The guys. Oh, the guys. I'm the guy. She's the guy. You're a I've, dude. We're all dudes. I've, You're I've, not the guy. I've That's reluctantly the guy. called them heroes. That was nice of you. Yeah, that was, <laughs> that was the best we got, wasn't it? <laughs> These are your heroes, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Yeah, there was an AA joke back in season one. Arca's anonymous. But y'all don't like Arca, so don't know why you'd be called that. So where are we now? So as you um as you pass through the teleporter, um you are brought to this immense library, this tower 
that extends high up and far down. Um, you are on the uh, the median level of this uh, of this pillar of sapphire crystal. And as it uh, rises up, you don't see a top to it, and you and as it uh, extends downward, you do not see a bottom to it. Wow. She was uh she dead, huh? <laughs> she was nice. Did you say we're in a tower? Or yes. in front of a tower. We're you are you are in front of the tower. Okay. Oh, we're, 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 I thought we were inside. We teleported, didn't we? Yeah, you teleported. You're right next to the library that is a tower, and you can you as you walk inside, then you see all that stuff. Okay. Oh. But on the outside, when you look down, um, there is an open chasm, and you see clouds. And beneath some of the parting of the clouds, you see the water. So one wrong step, and you're going down. We used to do the Tears of the Kingdom. We just... Yeah, no, because that totally... <laughs> just, like, died. That totally works. The Spider-Man 2, but you turn the fall damage on. <laughs> <laughs> Hope none of you are afraid of heights. Hmm. If you, I ain't afraid of falling. That's what you mean. Well, you can't die, so... I don't think I'm afraid of heights. You have your companions, Heather, Ruzier, and Arnold with you. Mm, or Heather. Oh, right, Ruzier. Or Heather. <laughs> Brought along for the ride. Yeah. What are we, what, what, what are we getting? Somebody refresh my memory. So we came here to go to the library. So we're here to read some books. I'll leave you the book reading. Me read book not well good. Haven't you been alive for such a long time? Shouldn't you know how to read? I do. I'm lying, but <laughs> Jesus doesn't want to read. Correct. Can you help please search for the book we're looking for? Uh, what the fuck are we looking? What book are we looking for? The compiled history of whatever the fuck we need. Looking for yes. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah, I'll look for actually. a book that says the history of exactly what you're looking for. I don't think you're gonna find that. <laughs> we actually find a book. <sighs> Roll investigation. <laughs> Is there a keeper in this library? Are they hot? Do you ask Brazier that? <laughs> yes. No. No. <laughs> Four. <laughs> uh, you find a book that says exactly that, and then as you pull it, it disappears. It's the fucking library. All right, who's going up? I'm or down. I'm going up because. Then I have to go back up on Major the way back. Ask the librarian. Nope. So walk up. The you wall. ask Ruzier if there's a keeper. Uh, yes, but um, she is not one you look directly in the eyes. Like. I can look. Can I look at their chest? Like she's. Like if I look her in the eyes, she's gonna bite my face off, or like. You just don't talk, Bob. It is considered a great honor to look upon the great librarian and uh, most uh, often do not get the opportunity. I see, so, so stare at their she chest. is extremely shy and doesn't like showing her face, clearly. Is the Great Librarian also a dragonborn? Dragonborn? Probably a dragon. There are many forms she takes. I wonder what she's decided Maybe to she say. Maybe the above. Anyways. <clears throat> Maybe we should go out. Uh, are we looking for books on um, their <laughs> facts and stuff? Well, that would probably be up a few ladders. You could probably ask the librarian. Where we're going, we don't need ladders. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I mean, I don't need ladders. <laughs> Just walk directly up it. Right. That's why I said I'm not afraid of falling. Oh, no, the edge. Ooh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Just run around to the other side. We should probably look up if there's any books on uh, 
<clears throat> What's his name again? I ain't seen shit up. Not literally look up. Oh, you're talking about this, uh... This, this man with eight names? Uh, yes, Adelgrim. That one. A, a B, C, D, E, F, U, right? That's what it is? <laughs> is it what? That's how you spell it? No. You... <laughs> is this lame? I, I don't think you know how to spell. So or the alphabet. Is Redmain R-E-C-K-L-I-T? No, it's W R E C K S H I T. Oh, I see. <laughs> and he has seven names. Oh, is, that, is it seven? He's got eight now because the last one's fucker. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, fucker? I'm going to kill your whole family for fun. I was having that issue in a game I was playing. It would click the option and just wouldn't do it, I think. Well, if we want to get to artifacts, it's a couple ladders up, and if you want to find out information on Adelgrim, then you might do well to go into books about the Dragon War. Is Heather wearing pants? <laughs> Why? <Yes. laughs> okay. She's going to go up the ladder after. Oh! <laughs> She's a degenerate. Hey, what are you looking you at? Look pervert! Oh, you pervert! <laughs> yeah, but they took it out in the remake. How could they? It's because Lance both of the massages. <laughs> we did a little bit of massaging. He made way more sexist jokes than the original. But I think it, but it was funny. It like wasn't like... I don't know, I guess... We woke now. By the way, so you guys go up ladders? No. He, but you yeah, walk he, up. he scales. <laughs> he scales the wall. Yeah, ladders. Do, 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 ladders. Do, 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 do. I'll go last. Can I just face that up there? If you want to waste that. That's only 30 feet. Do you want to waste your face step? This tower yeah. is tall. Oh shit, so we're going. How many down. times can you face step? Uh. Proficiency, right? Well, her special one, I think, is like more than that. Shit. For her race. I don't remember. Hold on, over here. Or is that. <laughs> Four times. That's a lot of times. Yeah, if you want to exhaust all your face steps, sure. Run the ladder. No, oh, yeah, we're gonna climb the ladder. <laughs> okay. As you get thirty feet up the ladder, go ahead and make me uh, is an it, athletics is check. Is it that far? Who? All of us? You. Oh me. First you. Wait, the ladder is that long? Yeah, it's a big ladder. It's a. This is a tower. You have to be an idiot to not climb a fucking ladder. Okay, I have a plus one. Hey, do you remember that other game where we had to climb ladders and you fell? <laughs> I I roll really bad. Exactly. Yeah, but I'm, I'm like, that was like a normal person. Okay, you it's make like you make land. it you make it halfway up the ladder. One more athletics check. I'm mm. a perfect human being. I can't fail a ladder check. Five. Uh, you slip, Bobby. You can catch her. <laughs> Are you gonna? You ask. The whole reason why I'm going last up the ladder is to catch people. All right, Oscar, do you try to catch her? Yes. <laughs> I'm not. I don't know if I can. I'm not strong. You can just okay. leave it to me. Redman can do it. Go ahead and roll me athletics. Yes, leave it to the strong one, please. Ah. Twenty-two. <laughs> Caught more rain. Seriously, can't even climb a ladder. It's very, it's very rickety and old. Why don't they get new ladders? The old ladders. They because they, they fly. fly. <laughs> <laughs> they ain't got money. The ladders are for the lower folk. <laughs> the money goes into building more floors. Thank you, Red Main. That was. Oscar, you're up. Yeah, it's a little scary. Yeah, so we'll first athletics check. Huh. Fuck you, Bobby. Why? What? I climbed my ass up to here. You climb your ass up here. Could I? You don't know 21. that. Okay. You now make it I halfway do. up. Next one. <laughs> you also missed. <laughs> A six. <laughs> you fall? Are you fucking serious? <laughs> 26. <laughs> Wait, man, I have an idea. Don't you have Lost a flying me. horse? 
Oh yeah, Peter. <laughs> Toss her. <laughs> Roll athletics. Uh, twenty. <laughs> As you say, Peter, he just like <laughs> appears as you're going up. Yeah, and you're like <laughs> that. Oh, how far did I go? <laughs> you went up. You went above where you're supposed to go. Okay, then, uh, Peter, catch me on your back. Okay. He just catches you. Okay, we need to go to that one. And I point where I want him to go. You have a carrot? Yeah, here. Uh, <laughs> I like carrots. And he just goes. Don't throw me. Do you, Don't. Need, me, do you need me to carry you? I forgot. Yes. That I was okay. Horse. So you put Moira on your back? Literally on my shoulder, like... and I'm just one handing this ladder. All right, athletics. 19. Take a minus three. 16. Her. Yeah, you're up. So, next one, minus three. Ha! One. <laughs> you both fall. I have a whip. Can I just... Sure. Batman it? I catch myself. What would that be under? Athletics also? Or uh, straight? Dex. Dex. How dare you make me roll an athletics roll? Plus three. Because it's funny. Natural 20. You catch onto the ladder and Redman catches himself and then you guys continue up the ladder and you make it up to the top. Good thing for my whip. These ladders weren't built for me. <laughs> yeah, they're, they're <laughs> fucked. They weren't really built very much. They aren't built for anyone. Ugh. And for the sake of time, you guys make it up the other ladder. Yada yada. Oh, you, don't, you want me to roll? I can roll. Oh, look. A oh, one. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> In that case, you break it. <laughs> you're break you're all fucked. You break the stairs. <clears throat> I mean, they're fucked. Uh, well, to be fair, they're fucked because Peter. I mean, he could take multiple trips, I guess. He could. Could shove you in the bag of holding and put you in my pocket. <laughs> Just hold your breath. No, no, that's not that's that's not the one that actually would let me fly. I don't have the one that would let me fly. Mm -hmm. All right, so you guys make it up to where um, Ruzier said that um, that would be the uh, the place where you'd find um, information on the artifacts. And I'd like everybody to roll me an investigation check, please. I'm not good at these yet. I need to level up. Seven. What was my investigation? Again? I'm also really bad at this. It was. Ooh, let's see. It's going to dice, Jill. 19. 21. 21. Four. A seven. What, is it an intelligence stat? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. <laughs> so, uh, wherein as you're looking, you find a couple books that might have what you need, but then you, along with Redmain, notice that there is a book missing from the shelf. Someone's checked out a book recently, I guess. Yeah, oh. I thought I thought it looked like. I assumed you saw something missing and just thought I stole it, but I did not take it. Yeah, I, I mean, you I... would have had time. No, I believe you would. You wouldn't <laughs> take it. Maybe yeah, why would you? Why would you steal books? Books don't seem your style. That's what I said. I mean, it I doesn't matter if you can sell them for a lot of money. It. Oh, um, I guess. What the noble who buys books for a lot of money says. <laughs> People will buy shit for for no reason whatsoever. There's a few personal copies in the vault. Yeah, I know. I've seen them. Can I ignore that. Mm. So maybe we can ask the librarian to <laughs> check out the book. Do we? Yeah. I'm gonna look for things on the dragon war. Take. Okay, we take no, okay, we should investigation. Well, I think I found it. Well. Enough. Uh, you do find a book on the Dragon War, and as you look through it, it is in Dracon. Mm. 
Wow. Worthless. I hand it to Heather. You know, there's also a, a dragonborn here, too. Yeah. What's his name? And then the other thing. The yeah, other? that's true. Hey, guys, look what I found. The mellow yellow. Is that his name? <laughs> what did you find? Oh, I just picked a random book. <clears throat> um. Uh, what you seem to have picked was a cookbook. Yeah, it's about... Cooking people. Put that back. <laughs> Funny enough, the yeah. Draconic translation is how to uh, how to season and cook mortals. Put that back. Who wrote that? I saw the pictures inside. We don't need to look at that. Is there isn't like there was like porn for naked. If by naked you mean dead and dismembered, yes. There, there's an anatomical image. <laughs> Does he cut off the dick? We don't want that part. He this just is the tainted part. <laughs> all off like the neck of the turkey. Uh -huh. Are you speaking from just... the heart there, or just like, we're make, still making a joke? <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's way over there. You're, you're closer. I just handed it to you. Okay. Uh, we're looking on for information on this Adelgrim person, right? Yeah. Well, it says here that he was instrumental in the Dragon War for, uh, along with uh, a few other companions, that uh, preserved life of the Draconic races. Um, he saved some eggs from each each color dragon in order to preserve the uh the bloodlines of all the all the dragon types so he's like a hero for the dragons yes and no but it sa it says that he was praised as a hero and his his uh actions afterwards are what made a lot of people hate him being that he served genesis and all Oh. So, you know, he did not die the hero. He lived long enough to see himself become the villain. Got it. And according to this, he is uh, still alive today. 2,000 years later. Has it got his uh, house address on there? Or... It says that he doesn't live in any one province or realm. He lives somewhere between. The fuck does that mean? That's what it says in this book. Like the astral planes? Like it? in between the pages or what? You missed a page? No, it's, <laughs> it's in between the uh, the draconic realms. So I believe still on this this plane of existence, but somewhere on the continent is where he lives. Very descriptive. So he lives here, but he doesn't live here? What if he was just in the middle? Isn't the middle where that church is? The Phoenixia one? No, yeah. that's Ha'amun. Yeah, and that's that's Phoenixia's uh, church. Let's not go there. I feel like someone might object. Yep. <laughs> you object. Me? <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> I didn't hear no objection. Say anything about what he likes? Like, what if we just made like a big pancake breakfast? Would that lure him out? Like, I some think kind I of don't. slumbering bear. I can put you on a plate naked and shove an apple up your ass if that's what you're asking. No. That sounds excessive. That sounds okay. Doesn't the apple usually go in the mouth? You would think that. <laughs> he doesn't die, so it should be fine. You're well, some weird like if he was there was a long him. distance between doesn't die and doesn't need to breathe, okay? They're not the same <laughs> thing. Also, you know, just because my heart doesn't beat doesn't mean I don't have feelings. <laughs> <laughs> but that's what that means. No, it does. That's what it means. I'm cold as ice. You're as cold <laughs> as ice. <laughs> now, what about the, the book that? Books that I got. Yeah. What about the missing book? 
as you <clears throat> flip through these books, these ones are in common. Mm-hmm. Oh, thank God. Um, yeah, these I can read. And as you uh, flip through them, it uh, it speaks of an artifact that um, that fell to Solaris two thousand years ago. It was uh, that of a a large ruby, which now sits in um sits where Ha'amun currently is the the temple was built around it and uh that is where um draconic magic um is preserved okay so we just need to go to that temple with the big ruby in it because that's the artifact where it fell what? An artifact fell like 2000. I don't no, no, the artifact is the ruby. Yeah, that's why. Yeah, that's it's... not what we're looking for. That's, though. that's not what we're here for. Oh, well, that's what it's that it mentions here. I think that's I just mean, history. I mean, I'll go there and I'll take the ruby. I'll cut your hands off and I'll shove them so far up your ass you'll never be able to get them back again. I don't think you'd have to. I feel like the dragons would just eat him. Yeah, you can't do that. <laughs> and if a dragon could catch me, I'm too small. I'm like a gnat. They, they would just go away. Oh, he's gone? Okay, good. <laughs> okay, anything else is, on the books? Is there, like, a system <clears throat> in place where we can find out what books are where? Like a Rolodex? Oh, like a Dewey Decimal <laughs> System? <laughs> no, sorry, they did not adopt the Dewey Decimal System here. That's in mythos. Ah. So it was just like alphabetical, random chance. Uh, it seems to be alphabetical. So what are we in the fucking oh. A's? Alphabetical. The AAs? Oh, the like, AD. That. What a, what a terrible BD, system. BD, before dragons. You can always ask one of the Sapphire Dragonborn that are, uh, that are roaming the library. Oh. And ask them what book is supposed to be there. All right. Who wants to nominate themselves to ask a Sapphire Dragonborn and have them look at you with disgust? Because I guarantee you that's what's going to happen. If you I'm got it. Razier. <laughs> <laughs> if they're not going to look at him with disgust. There's no point in sending him that. Then we'll actually get what we're able to for. give him more information. It's more no. It's more fun to struggle and then send in the big guns. Then you go yourself. No, I refuse to be humiliated anymore. So you want to do Arnold first? No, not Arnold. For Arnold, <laughs> just <laughs> they will kick him off the fucking cliff and he'll they fall. They will. Is that <laughs> what I know? Yeah. Diva Saba. Nope. Whatever he said, I don't know, but I don't, I don't. I, uh, he's asking why you keep saying his name. Should I tell him what you've been saying? No. No. Save it for later, just oh, in case. I mean, just tell him we've been talking about how helpful he's been. Okay. <laughs> she translates. Ah, I want to see that. I think I can get it. All right, what do we uh So we'll have to ask somebody uh Rizir. Rizir, you want to ask? Also ask me about the book that's missing. Yeah. Well, the book word. Well, do you want to ask some <laughs> sapphire dragons about the books missing on the shelf? Dragon dragon. Sure. Whatever. I I can do that for you. Thank you. Bobby, could you get lost or something? Are you sure you want that to happen? See what no. about No, because you would, after what you said, I think you would about to steal something. Oh, yes, the book that was over there. Oh, you also speak common. Good. <laughs> it's a, you know, this library got forbidden section. I'll find it. No, don't. The book that is... Uh, Missing. That was uh, taken a while ago, and it hasn't been returned. It was uh, a couple months ago. Do they have rules for that? Wow, who would take things and not return them? Gee, that sounds like a really bad. Well, person. I wasn't here, but I heard that it was a a group of mortals. Ah. Uh. Look the like? different group of mortals, not us. Just the first time I've ever I, been I here. I bought the sketcher. Do you want to look like this? They just said they weren't here. 
He it wasn't here. Yes. I, th- I think I heard someone talking about that person. So they, was, they stood out. What was the book we took? A book on amulets and artifacts. What happened if they left a few months ago, I wonder? They've gotten an exuberant amount of late fees. Did they check out any other books, like How to Romance a Dragon? Let me go check if that section's empty. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely. The, the how-to section? Looks like that other freaking mortals are always... A... I feel like they, all they did was come here and fuck things up and then left. Yeah. Hey. Sounds like mortals. Sounds like... I believe mortals are quite misunderstood creatures. We've been studying them for quite some time. I'm you. Uh, not you specifically. Yeah, yeah, you're, I get you're it. Kind. Yeah. Um, I do believe that they are rather misunderstood creatures. And um, so I, the, the great librarian has, uh, has asked us to keep a lookout for that book. Uh, however, she will not be... Uh, you know, uh, bringing down any punishment if they were to return it. You sure you don't want to let this uh, dragonborn study you? Is this a dragonborn oh, it, would be, a dragon? it would be a great honor to be able to to study a mortal in person. Okay, maybe later. <laughs> um, but, I mean... Yes, yes, thank you. Uh, my name is Kazak. I'm Oscar, nice to meet you. Oscar. Fascinating. Yes, thank you. Uh, uh, I mean, uh, it's truly my honor to speak with a mortal. You don't talk to a lot of mortals? No, no and then I, I don't we're get a literally to, the only to, ones on this entire oh, planet. No. To flex my, my common uh, as uh, as often as I'd it's like. Very good. Thank, thank you. Uh, it, it's still a work in progress. Uh, yeah, don't worry about it. You speak better common than some of us here. Me, it's me. Yeah, I, it's me. <laughs> you for being immortal your skin is quite pale you're I mean we usually do not he doesn't deal go out with, in the sun much with mortals of that color although yeah. one of the other mortals yeah, that we're, was we're here also colorful. had skin similar to yours so it was more gray we we certainly are not a colorful folk as, as you are he doesn't like the sun it's like all the color was fuck you guys him. I can handle the sun just fine <laughs> See? <laughs> Fascinating. So the sun harms you. No, it's a little, that was, it's a little that was dramatic effect. He was just being oh, dramatic. Uh, it is a, a joke. <laughs> yes. I I've, I've read of these. <laughs> uh, we uh we don't really joke around up here. I mean, I've tried, but most everybody takes me seriously. Oh no, he's sino. Try, like, um, doing really bad joke puns. Wait, you're telling me dragons don't joke? I feel like of all the races that should joke, it should be the fucking 80 feet tall, you know, paragons of death. I would that would up, be the funniest fucking thing. Look up a book called Dad Jokes. Dad Jokes? To just... Yeah, those are the good ones you could tell. What is a dad? Father. Like, um... Oh, a paternal figure. Oh, yes. Yeah, like, they're called dad jokes because they make really bad jokes, but they're also kind of funny. So, paternal figures in mortal culture make terrible jokes? They think they're funny, but they're not. But then they're sometimes funny because they're so bad. It's so funny that it's... Maybe I'm glad I didn't oh, have a dad. I, I, I think I have one. Uh, knock, knock. Who's there? Nobody. Nobody who... <laughs> yeah, just like that. Keep yeah. it up. That's the people. Got it. You gotta yeah. lose, use a little improvement. I'm trying to think of a sign of jokes he's made. Um, he just keeps laughing. Oh, oh, that gets me every time. I laugh most a everyone, bit myself most because everyone doesn't get it. No, it's pretty good. That is a good one, actually. Good, good. <laughs> you, yeah. That was funny. You... You guys didn't think that was funny. You said it was funny. Oh, I I have another one. Knock knock. Who's there? Somebody. Somebody who? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> the other one's a lot funnier. 
Should I roll performance? <laughs> <laughs> to see if you can yeah. fake laugh? Hey, wait, wait, no, no, I got one. I got one for you to use on your dragon friends. Oh, gosh. Oh, please. I would love to hear it. Right. Uh, mm. It's too late now. No. Knock, knock. Uh, who's there? Dragon. Dragon who? Dragon these nuts across your face. <laughs> <laughs> He's just appalled. (laughs) (laughs) Of course he is. I don't believe there's a draconic translation for a lot of that. Bobby! Yes? What? (laughs) Why are you here, Bobby? (laughs) I wouldn't use that joke. Bobby, come on. He's just getting the dead joke. That was good. Why? I right, couldn't do Goblin. That was too obvious. <laughs> goblin. <laughs> goblin? Oh, I, I got one. <laughs> Spell, um, I hop. And then say Niss at the in, end. In common? In common, and then say Niss at the end. <laughs> I H O P Niss. Now say it fast. I'm going to go to the section. <laughs> I don't get it. You just said you ate my dick. What is a dick? A penis, a dick. It's what's in between the human light, human. Uh... Oh, the, the mortal reproductory, uh, uh, sexual reproduction organs. Oh, <laughs> I <get it. laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> we, we, uh, we dragonborns don't don't have those. What do you have? It's it's something different, but mm. quite similar, but different. I see. <sighs> this has gotten painfully awkward, and so I'm gonna leave to find more books. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm just like, oh, God. I'm gonna go look at more books. Oh, I got I got one. Oh my God! <laughs> what now she's are... looking them up. What yeah. The... yeah. Now she... Either you looked it up or somebody in chat said one. What does the toaster say to the slice of bread? What is a toaster? Fuck! He doesn't get it. You also don't know, know what a toaster, toaster is either. Is. Damn! I can't make no, this joke. You can't make the joke. Damn! Oh, that's all the mythos. Did you have a toaster in your house? Okay, I didn't have toast for breakfast. You did have toast for breakfast, but. I don't you think don't, I you don't know what a toaster is. You don't know what a toaster is. It was just crispy bread. Yeah, yeah it was just cris- crispy bread. Crispy bread. Crispy bread. Could you like cook it for me? Crispy bread. Wait, what is the punchline to do that joke? Get in me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I could make the joke that because the food is not toaster. I think I know what it would say exactly. Get in me. No, something else. I want you inside me. Oh. I don't want to say it. Just say it. What, the, what did the bread? What did the toaster say to the bread? Oh, come inside come, me. Exactly. Yeah. Oh. Mm. Mm. That would make it funnier. Oh. I was trying to think I can make this. <clears throat> anyway, are we gonna find the books? <laughs> I'm. I've already left. <laughs> yeah, I was looking. How many more books. ladders do I have to get to the G section? You trying to find the G spot? <laughs> <laughs> He he set himself up for that one. Okay. <laughs> what do you call a lost lycanthrope? Uh, I don't know. What? A werewolf. Uh-huh. <laughs> 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 oh, that is a good one. We don't get many lycanthropes here. No, I'm probably not. What did the peasant say to the king? What? Help, help, I'm being repressed. <laughs> uh-huh. oh, that's what a lot of kobolds say. Uh-huh. No offense. Uh-huh. <laughs> Just the no offense, Arnold. Is he with the bad He is quite repressed. I wouldn't try. Oh, no. <laughs> Stop it. Oh, am I blurry? Why is it this one's a Jissit Elves? Well, it's a good thing no one hears an L. It's a good thing we all hate elves here. What do you call a goblin with a limp? I don't know what. A gob hoblin. Cause he's hobbling. 
get it? <laughs> I was looking at this one too. <clears throat> <laughs> what are you doing? I fixed the blurry. That was blurry. He was apparently blurry. All fixed. No, he just has too many pixels IRL for the camera to pick it up. Oh, I know. <laughs> this one's for Dragon that, One. Is that an insult? <laughs> How to drive that that joke? <laughs> How to drive <laughs> How fucking dare you? And I, I, I made those weapons for you. I finally did it. And you fucking, you come back to that shit. <laughs> I'm working on my weight, okay? Now you look great. Thank you. How do dragons rate their satisfaction with their lives? I don't know how. On a scale. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh, Oscar's been waiting to use these his whole life. He's had them compiled. This is, this is Oscar's part moment. If you, keep telling it, if you tell one more terrible joke, I will what find. Do you mean they were good? I will find the forbidden section. What the fuck are you talking? They were good. Oh, you're looking for the forbidden section? No, don't. I'm not even here. I wasn't. <laughs> well, I was, was keeping my hands to like myself. myself to I'm, I'm the one who's not here. Oh, yeah. Well, you would need uh, express permission to uh, access the forbidden section. Um, Did uh, she give us anything like that? Wh who is this she that you were speaking of? The Amethyst the Dragon Lady. Oh. Queen Amethelia. Yeah, her. Oh, well, if you were sent here by her, then by all means, I suppose I should Don't allow you me. into the forbidden section. I was going to allow you anyways because you all gave me such a... Oh, wonderful chuckle. <laughs> Damn, I didn't know it was that easy. Yeah, where's the forbidden section? Lead, lead the way. I need to go there. No. Right this way. I would also like to. I'll go too. <laughs> oh, I just keep an eye on him. Are you? You already left? I, you, I, could, I, was, I could not stand all of the terrible jokes. I should do stand up. You should sit down. Damn it. There's no chairs here. Maybe there are. So, for you at the G-spot. Yep, the G-spot. <laughs> I found the G-spot. Guys, it exists. <clears throat> no one's there but you. Um, what specifically about Genesis are you looking for? Uh, That's a good question. I guess, like, maybe general background on Genesis and his followers and stuff like that. Okay. Um, go and roll me investigation. <clears throat> Thirteen. Uh, as you sift through a few books, um, you do find one in common uh, about Genesis and the Cult of the Flaming Eye. And um, his presence in... Um, in Solaris. And as you read through, it seems that a lot of his uh, mortal followers uh, have not been here, but some have. It seems he has somewhat of a connection between here and Terra that he can funnel them through, but only a few at a time. So the possibility this is and this is uh these books are constantly updated mm -hmm. so there's like a there's a, a writer's note that also an says an addendum an addendum that says it is quite possible that there are more mortals in solaris than we originally thought mm. uh have seen uh cultists roaming about uh lands of mianuk Cluene and other uh, realms as well. Um, and further also, um, it uh, it says that the 
Temple of Genesis in Ru'ug is currently abandoned. And then there is another addendum to it. It seems that there was activity there not more than two months ago. Write that down, write that down. I'm you're not, not you're not near I'm totally oh ready down. Down. <laughs> my bad it's just i was answering somebody no, you I fucking don't. take notes there's a literal <laughs> note section on your character sheet yeah i know i know right. i don't know what he was saying it's fine don't worry about it <laughs> something that I, just, I just wanted to say that for once <laughs> <laughs> like, some of these a little of those and perfect <laughs> when did you get this one or is this the green one oh, this is the green one I fucking thought it was blue i'm gonna roll the ice the eye the ice the eye dice the eye dice the die the dice die this will be my dice today maybe not all right well i'm gonna I'm gonna grab this book and take it with me back to my friends. This dice is cursed. Maybe see if there's a book about Genesis champions here as well before I go back. Another investigation check. Go to the how to section. How to section? How to kill a god. <laughs> 21. Um you do find a uh a book that uh details Genesis champions. Oh, can I read it? Uh, it is in Draconic. I right, take it with me. You should learn Draconic. I should learn Draconic. It'll never be useful again after this. Never know. Right. If Oscar's plan goes through and, you know, dragons are reintroduced to the world, Draconic might be useful. Mm. Maybe we could start with Dragonborn. They look like people, just colorful, scaly people. Yeah. No way that'll I'm backfire. A, I'm a colorful furry person. Maybe it'll work. No, we just genocided you. <laughs> That's why I said there's no way it'll backfire. That's true. You were too furry. Yeah, just look at the Leonin. Oh, mm -hmm. shit. Uh, look at the Eladrin. Oh, oh shit. No. Um, <laughs> look at the ASMR. Oh, fuck. <laughs> look at the... Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> the Dwerg. God. <laughs> Oh. Hmm. <laughs> well, the tieflings actually seem to be prospering to some well, extent. Well, same thing with the Eladrin, but just in a, a different context, just in yeah. a completely different area. It's almost like they just shouldn't be on Terra. Terra's just a fucking terrible place. That's terrible. Ah, ah, ah. Did not fucking think about that before I said it. <laughs> before you named it. Uh, it's Latin for land. I know that. Yeah. All right. Well, time to find my friends. Back, back to where <laughs> they were. English for shitty. <laughs> so, um, Kazakh has taken you to the forbidden section. The forbidden zone. Here is uh, where our most sensitive books are uh, about a uh, very, very top secret. Uh, information and topics and um so what are you looking to uh find out about anything uh, specific? Um, the artifacts yes. of genesis the that and also what what's 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 this what's this fuck uh kelm yeah you wish to learn more about the god of hatred yeah and why the dragons stopped worshiping him oh, yes i do have a history of uh why the dragons stop worshiping the uh i mean good choice is uh, what i have to say about that the three uh the forbidden three would you... we've come to call them <clears throat> why would you worship the fucking god of hatred sons like a no that doesn't sound like a very positive reinforcement relationship right there well the metallic dragons were uh quite uh mean hateful long you could time just, ago you could just say hateful they were rude they were <laughs> bad vicious more vicious. like that was the next word Wonder don't we gotta go over to where they are i think next 
We were at the Metallicus. No, we were at the. You were at the. You went. You were in the gold dragons. Oh, that's Metallics. That's where we started. And then the gem. Oh, dragons. we got to go to the chromatics. The chromatics. There you go. Who did they worship? Genesis. Right. Since we're in the forbidden section, any spell books around here that I can, I don't know. Look hey, through? that's a good question. Uh, spell books. Yeah. Um, depends on which school of magic you'd like to, uh, a spell book from. Okay. What kind of wizard hold, are you? Hold, hold that thought. Hold that thought. Hold that thought. <laughs> Conjuration, <laughs> abjuration. I forgot. So you, you evocation, can, you divination. Can, you can copy any. It yeah. costs one less. is cheaper. Yeah, it costs less if you're doing it from your own school. Yeah, one, it one costs cheaper. money to do this, by the way. I think I did choose. I think you should just get the scroll of fireball and call you gotta, it. You gotta <laughs> she has fireball. I yeah, fire. she has fireball. Oh, she never used uh, it. We have fifth level spell slots, right? We're high enough level for that, right? Yeah, yeah. fifth level spell slots. I think you guys even have sixth level. No. Oh, no, you're not that's level 12. Level, I think, is that level 12? I don't know if that's level 12. I think that's level 13. I'm pretty sure it's level 12. I have six level. Do you get six level spell slots? Oh, then you get six level spell slots at 11. Oh, yeah, yeah, because you get six level spell slots in Baldur's Gate, huh? Yeah. And then you get uh, get seven seven at 13, seven yeah. And then eight at 15. And then nine at 17, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep, that math checks out. Yeah, it's it's always the one up divided by two. So Mm -hmm. it's the level. It's it's every every odd level. Yeah. Same thing with uh, with uh, sneak attack dice for rogues. Yes. But I just want to level 12 so I can get a goddamn three. <laughs> While that's going on, uh, there you go. Oscar, you were looking for uh, the artifacts of genesis specifically yeah oh yes i do have a i do have a book here uh detailing the uh, the seven artifacts in question sorry <laughs> now you realize he said seven when you originally only knew of six do you say seven i thought there was only six. Oh no there's clearly seven <clears throat> i didn't I, I don't like that I don't so like the sound okay. of that one what about bit. the seventh one, then? Uh, yes. Um, what are the seven? Oh, God, I don't know why I even asked that. Uh, this, uh, this seventh one is a pair of boots. Um, and they seem to be a piece melded with, uh, with another god energy. Not just Genesis. It is also seems to be a piece of the creator. So it's got Genesis and Arca in it? And it didn't just explode? Correct. This uh, this seventh piece is said to be uh, where Arca took his first steps. Is where? Uh, somewhere near Terra. Arca's first step <laughs> is an island <laughs> on Terra. Oh, right. Is it still there? It's, right, it's off. It's off the coast of Cordova, actually. We're not there anymore, close. It doesn't say. Okay, I need something. I need one. You're going. You're looking in the wrong place. Oh, yeah. No. It'd be, it'd be features. And then arcane tradition just says war magic. Oh well, that's what she picked. War magic. She didn't pick. Yeah. A, she didn't pick a school. So, oh. she can, so she doesn't get she doesn't a get discount on any, any specific school. Yeah. Why does she pick a school? Okay. Does she not get to pick? A school? No, there's different. There's there's all there's, You could pick one of the schools of magic, or there's also chronomat chronomancy and war magic and uh, the other one. Dunomancy from Critical Role. Yeah. I don't know. A lot of people pick that. Usually, people just pick a school. Well, it's because there's like nine schools. There's or a lot of different schools, and they all do different things. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but after racing. Abjuration is tanky wizard that I would never want to die ever again wizard. Oh, or divination is one where you have divination dice. Where you get the divination That's dice. Important like. Evocation is spell sculpting. Yeah, evocation lets you not hurt your friends with Lucky fireball. Lucky with divination 
wizard. Divination wizard is extremely good, just also like from an RP and like a. It's like, okay. you, you, if you have a divination wizard, you should never get. You should always know what you're walking into at every time. You should never be surprised by anything. If they're playing their character yeah. good. I mean, you can play a dumbass divination wizard. That's perfectly fine. <laughs> <clears throat> anyway, stuff on, then try another book on the medallion. Let me check the bones. Well, the medallion is Says in <laughs> this book, and it is a, uh, it is, uh, a dragon medallion with a sapphire gem inlaid. Yep. Yeah. Um, and as you're hearing this described, this perfectly reminds me <clears throat> of what Onam had around his neck. Do we know the whereabouts of his medallion? Um, last we know, um, it was it was brought to us, and then we lost track of it. Well, you know he was swooped up by a red dragon, so we gotta go get to oh. talk to the red dragons at some point. Oh yeah, is that where we're going next? <clears throat> I think so. You're heading to the chromatic realm. Uh, yeah, uh, we gotta ask them a few questions. Some please. major things happened recently there. I I would not go. Oh, what is major? There was a, um, a uh, altercation. What does that mean? Between who? Between dragons. A bit of infighting. And that concerns me. How? Well, um, I just would really not like you to be put in danger. Well, we have to go there. Don't what? worry. I can handle a few dragons. Shut up. I highly doubt that. No offense, I we're, just... We're, mortal, it, mortals' capabilities have Amathelia said that to, to go into an area in that city that was more welcoming. So there was a section in where those dragons are. Well, if you're talking about a side of the infighting, that would be in Frus, yeah. in White Dragon territory. Mm. With uh, Queen Isla in uh, Usil. That was she told us. It is now. I think so. Because I don't remember. Me neither. I was too distracted by her. Uh, but if you were assets. looking to avoid the conflict entirely, uh, Lisul is a good spot. Uh, we go though, there too. Though it is uh, quite hot, it is a desert. <laughs> so, uh, you should be used to that. I'm totally used to desert. You wonder, you, you wait. How do do we know how Cactagon reproduce? Because they're plants, right? Are you talking about Cactagon openly? Yeah. Oh, Cactagon. You know of Cactagon? Yeah, yeah. We met yeah. Them. The f they. You have. Cactagon, where you come from. Yeah, there's a bunch of them now. Just pull out the needles. Y yeah. They originated here in Solaris. Oh, so they're there. Stick. Uh, Cactagon are quite terrifying. Ruthless. <laughs> they're pretty nice. They're, you could befriend them. They're not, they, they just like water. They go cheap, cheap. Yes, that is the uh, Cactagonian language. Uh, we've been trying to decipher it for many years to well, we no can, avail. We can just speak to them. Well, I mean, you, you could use magic. You've been able to speak with magic with the Cactagon. Well, at least I can understand them. <clears throat> Fascinating. Fascinating. You know, you know what I just realized? What was his name? I could talk to them telepathically because Which, they have a language. You mean the Cactagon? <laughs> yeah, was it Kevin? Edward. Uh, Edward? Yeah. Why is he thinking Kevin? I don't know. Because we always name our... Friends, dumbass names like Kevin or Greg or. No offense to Kevin's. <laughs> or Greg's. Yeah. <laughs> Fred. To anybody named Kevin out there. Or yeah. Greg or Fred or right. Bob or. Yeah. Jeff Jefferson. Mm hmm. How dare you? <laughs> it was Jeffrey Jefferson. <laughs> my apologies. But he went by Jeff. No, no. Yeah, you, you said my name is Jeff. My name is yeah. My name is yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so he went by Jeff. <clears throat> I'm not wrong. I did both of them. My name is Jeff. And Jeffrey. Jeffrey Jefferson. My name is Jeff. Oh. Punch the audience. Okay. I see. Why are you? Sorry. Why are you punching my mic? I'll just get. Rip everybody's earphones. You heard me talking shit. That's why. <laughs> Sorry. 
Do you guys have this? Yeah, it's true. The whole library and you guys can't comprehend every language? We are working on it. We almost have everything compiled. You have like a spell? That in um in one of these spell books, yes, I I I think we do. Well, give um, give the spell books to the smart one over there, and then uh. Well, while he while he's doing that, I'm gonna. Um, in this one, this uh, this has um, the comprehend languages spell and uh, the tongues spell. Uh, it allows you it uh, tongues allows you to. Uh, to cast it on yourself or uh, or another creature, and it gives you the ability to speak and understand uh, any creature. That's better than comprehend. Yeah, languages. it's a third level spell. Comprehend languages is mostly for written. Mm-hmm. Too bad I can't learn spells like that. Uh, I'm not a I'm wizard. Also useful and probably to grab. Yeah, then you uh, can you can speak or <clears throat> and understand tongues. any language. Tongue. That that would come in handy. <clears throat> I found a spell that like <laughs> she found an office spell that she really wants. <laughs> what spell? Let me see. What's the spell? Oh yeah, that's in there. <laughs> <laughs> but it's at six level, so I was like, should I do it? You only have one spell. You wanna, block. You, okay. <laughs> you know that takes like three turns, right? Doesn't it? It's just revenge. <laughs> There was another one I saw, but that one I caught what, my what eye is, and I was like, "Flesh to stone." Flesh to stone. Yeah, it's it's a say it's a save three times or fail three times. Mm-hmm. So it's like death. It's, it's death. Yes, yeah, essentially. Well, do you think that's just, really gonna? What kind of save is it? Con. It's con. It's a con save. This late in the game, I don't know. How no, yeah, I, that just, would be? I saw this and I was like, "Hey, I mean, there's combos that work with that." Yeah, but it's called. Hexcon. <laughs> yeah, called Hex. Yeah, well, you Hexcon, they have, have disadvantage. She's not a warlock. Ain't none of us a warlock. No. But you have it, don't you? I mean, you bestow no, curse. she has bestow curse, which does the same thing. Yeah, the bestow thing? curse, you could bestow curse to make them have disadvantage on con saving throws. Disadvantage? Curse stuff always fail your con saving throws. That seems cheap. Yeah, it, it it, that it, that's going because the spell already well, yeah. has yeah, an it, option to like make gives them disadvantage. Yeah, to go I know. Above that, to make them always fail, that's like that's rude. That's broken AF. Mm-hmm. And I would be like, um, vetoed. No. Yeah, it already has disadvantage on abilities too. Yes. Yeah, but if they have like a plus, they have like if they have a plus like ten. Then... No, you could all. You but also... disadvantage is disadvantage. Yeah, but not with you. You could also here. probably just curse them to not be able to add bonuses to make it straight roll yeah that's 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 rough too it depends what like at least it's at least better than always failing yeah yeah well it's, i mean it, it depends what the dm allows if say if i wanted to if he'd let me do it if i if i well the disadvantage, it, the disadvantage he has to no but i'm saying well if, if yeah that that's allowed but like if he wanted to have me do that he could probably make it fair by having me cast it at a higher level Mm-hmm. In order to have that be a thing. Did I find my friends yet? Yes. Uh, one of the Sapphire Dragonborn holds uh, holds you up. Hello. I'm sorry, this is the forbidden section. You were not allowed in. Uh, my companions have already gone inside. We were teleported here by the, uh, the Amethyst Dragon. By that amethyst dragon, the the, the queen mm-hmm. amethyst dragon. I'm sorry, I still can't let you in. I have a, and, I have a, a could... scale of. She <laughs> she handed me a scale. That's proof, you know, and that I've been there. Oh, that is Queen Amethelia's necklace. Please. <clears throat> Maybe let's Thank you. you could just learn harm using that item. Harm. Is that a wizard spell or is that a cleric spell? It's it might be spell. a cleric spell. Never mind. Technically, wizards can learn from any from any spell list. They just that's have to have the scroll never, for That's it. why I never had uh, money, because Gale would be learning every spell. Yeah, because yeah, Gale can learn, like, Cure Wounds. If they had, if you had a scroll of Cure Wounds, he can learn it. He just uh, dies if you breathe on him. Cure wounds. He just dies if you breathe on him. If yeah. you want to heal the party instead, sure. It's not like I do. I think I have Max Cure Wounds. I do. Yeah, yeah, I think you have that. Mask your wounds is great. 
It's not very good in Baldur's Gate. It's good because you don't have to touch. Yeah. Yeah, I know. Well, it just doesn't heal enough by the time you get yeah. Any yeah. healing spell where you don't have to touch is great. Yeah. All right. Did I learn anything about uh, the gods and their relationships with the dragons? Yes. What you learn um, is that uh, the... <clears throat> Oh, Raw says only if it's on the wizard spell list. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think that's stupid. I do too. Agreed. I am going to rule that you can do it with any spell. That is my choice. Fuck anybody who doesn't. I'm just kidding. No, it's fine. If you don't agree, that's fine. We can make a debate out of it. Um, you just have to be able to put it into the character sheet. Yeah, sure I just, wizards, yeah. Can wizards learn any spell in Baldur's Gate? No, it yeah. has to be on the... I, on Baldur's Gate, it's probably on the, it has to be a wizard spell. I don't know. No, Baldur's Gate. Well, I know for sure you, it won't from... let you learn to speak dead. Counter spell. That's uh, weird. Yeah, it's true. It's like a cleric thing. You need counter spell. Yeah, right? Oh, yeah, you don't have counter spell? No, no. she has to spell magic. Yeah. Remember, again, I made this character you can't, you can't. a while ago. User. Counter spell is actually important to your class. Yeah, that's all I was like. User. Oh, counter spell. You could get counter spell. User. <laughs> I don't even know what the war mages get. It's true, you didn't really know what you were doing, so you just, I don't know, built it. Yeah, this was the, made this character a while ago. Um, so you learn uh, why the Metallics stopped worshipping Keln uh, after the integration of um, Phoenixia into their beliefs. It uh, They became a lot more calm and open to the other oh so Kelm uh, fucking hates phoenixia the thing. other dragons yeah he, I mean, he hates a lot of things <laughs> um and they have... right hate is a strong word it really 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 doesn't like her um let's see there we go okay uh and the the temple that is uh that is to keln next to aur uh has been um sealed ever since uh when it came to um to the dragons of jawel um the temple closest to kura ig in mianuk uh, the temple to Shivala uh, was also sealed when they when turning to Phoenixia allowed them to trust other dragons and <clears throat> the temple of Genesis near Ruug um was sealed did but did not remain that way um after the chromatic dragons learned of phoenixia's warmth and ability to breathe life into into you got, lost causes you guys doing a lot of the heavy lifting here um they decided to uh, forsake Genesis's wrathful and destructive ways. So, the Forbidden Three are Forbidden. completely uh, and utterly angry at all of Dragonkind. And it was said that they would one day return and wreak havoc upon all of Solaris. Is that day to day? Is that what's happening? What have you learned? Why do you believe that it's today? No reason. Please, I would really, <laughs> really appreciate if you were to... What today? Let's completely... just say the Amethyst Dragons aren't doing too hot. We came from the, the Amethyst Queen and they were... Pretty much being attacked. We left before. And it has already begun. What's begun? 
the end times, I guess. The Forbidden Three's revenge. There you go. Hmm. Can't we do anything about it? Them? No, probably not. Us oh. two, maybe. Oh, wait, I finally found you guys. Two. Place yeah, you huge. and me. <laughs> the only ones who are chosen here. <sighs> chosen? You mean... You are... Champions. Sure. Champions of who? Champion <laughs> <laughs> of Ekla. Ekla. Unfortunately. He Interesting died. choice. He didn't really right. choose. Yeah. He didn't get to choose. I was, there was free will. I definitely chose. Okay. Saying that out loud, making it true. <laughs> 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 And yourself? Phoenixia. You are the champion of the Harmonious One. Oh, I even want to study you even more. Uh, wonderful. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so that he believes me. He already believes me. Show him your chest. <laughs> no, no, I know. It's like Superman. Oh, pay up. <laughs> so I'm wearing my Spidey suit under or something. It means hope. Yeah, well, here it's an ass. <laughs> yeah, well, here it's an ass. <laughs> Love those videos. That's funny. Ass stands for hope. <laughs> yeah. What an um, idiot. <laughs> are you guys? Okay. They're making Glasses fun of up. Commissioner Gordon, where did you go? Oh, no. They're oh, making fun of Superman. <laughs> yeah. I think I've seen those videos. All right. So maybe you are the ones that could help us uh, fight back the Forbidden Three. Hell, I'm all for killing a god or three. Works for oh, me. <laughs> killing them would not be possible uh, you'll never fact, know until you try in fact taking any of the gods out of the pantheon could cause a destabilization of the realm and could effectively end uh, the world as we know it so can we just seal them? <laughs> sealing is a is a way of dealing with them but Wait. you will then have to deal with them every time they become unsealed. Wait, that's theoretical though no one's ever Kill the god and see what happened. This is just theoretical. No gods have ever been destroyed so from we don't what know. from our. What from if our we knowledge. just killed the gods this time? Killing them isn't working. That's the same thing as killing them just temporarily. What if we just ended them permanently? Not but very harmonious are, of you. Uh, yes, it is. I'm getting <laughs> rid of the evil to bring harmony because they're destroying this land. How yeah, about that? Can make more. Well, we don't know. If they, what? Who came up with the idea that that's what would happen? Who told Who told people that? There's mixed reports and hearsay, but from what we can gather is that it was Arca's words himself. Maybe. But it's never happened, so it's still theoretical. I believe that sure. if it would have been possible, Arca would have gotten rid of them long ago. I see. Huh. But we can seal them. Are we sure? But they stay sealed for a while. I never met no Arca, but would you want to destroy your own creations? Yes. If they're Shut up, you. <laughs> Oscar. I'm trying totally, to make a great I'm, point here. Oscar's Maybe... totally okay with killing their children. Maybe he well, loves all his children. Considering that they are Arca's children, children I would believe that he probably would not want to like slaughter his own. Life, you so, know. Maybe it's kid. not. Maybe it's not the fabric of reality holding him back, but you know. Maybe he's not, maybe he's just saying that because he doesn't want to kill them because they're his like children, I guess. I suppose that is a possibility, but I am not one to. Uh, go against the will of the gods. 
I am. <laughs> I mean, I just, you know, it's not that I don't believe them. I just like to question things. Oh, that's just my, that's just my, you know, my, oh, it my is nature. Perfectly all right to theorize, but to go against the will of the gods is blasphemy. Yeah. I'm a blasphemer. I'd be blaspheming all over the place. Okay, could you just stop me? Our champions don't sound very champion like. <laughs> We're talking about killing evil, not killing children. Yeah. We're punishing them for being evil. I don't see they shouldn't. She shouldn't have a problem with that. If they're killing innocents because they're assholes, then why shouldn't we kill them? Yeah, but in their point of view, killing innocents would bring for them. You know, though that that's them thinking like, oh, it's for the better. No, they're not doing it because for the better. They're doing it because they're mad. Because they're big mad. That's why they're doing that. Well, he is the they're god of hate. Better. Oh. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. They're just doing it just because they're angry, not because there's a rationality behind it. Look, I don't care. Whatever gets rid of them. And by the time they come out of ceiling, the next generation will have to deal with it because I will be dead. Are you sure? <laughs> You're a champion. I won't. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> forgotten. <laughs> Damn it, I forgot. I'm going to live forever now. Yeah, so now... You're going to live until you die, at least. Oh, well, that's everyone. I mean... They have to extra try. <laughs> they have to. Ah! Just like, I'm just like. <laughs> I keep forgetting. At least I'll stay beautiful and young forever. I mean, I live 500 years, but I'm not 500 years old. Well, I mean, even if you, you got were, a long life ahead young, of you. I got a long death. You elves live forever. Ahead of me. I'm only like 100. Anyway, shouldn't we. Are we done here? Well, oh, I think I found where we need to go next. Where? Uh, Rug. Rug. Is that what you were talking about? We okay. want to head to Rug. Well, that's that's a bad, bad no. Where's no, that? No, no, no. Well, according that's to Red Dragon territory. According, yeah, to... but we need to go fucking be down some Red Dragon trees and see if we can't get some Red Dragon fruit because we need some goddamn Red Dragon knowledge. According to this book, Genesis Temple has been active for the past two months. And then we gotta go desecrate Genesis Temple just because. So shit, piss all over it. Yes. No, also, I desecrate, not defecate. Oh, also, uh, <laughs> let's, let's remember that Onan was taken by a red dragon. So, by someone that had plans because of Genesis? No. I... Like the red dragon working for Genesis? No. I, I, don't I know. mean, let's let's see. He I've never met wearing, a red dragon. He was wearing one of the artifacts of Genesis that shot a beam into the sky, and then a red dragon came and took him away. I'm not talking about Onan, I'm talking about. That sounds pretty uh, cut the, and dry I'm there. About the red dragon's not him. The amulet didn't really seem evil. Oh no! Why would the amulet react like that against his will, unless the one who created the amulet had something to do with it? The this book also said that there are probably cultists all over. I fucking Solar. love killing cultists. Let's go. <laughs> Apparently, Genesis has a a way to teleport cultists from Terra to here. This sounds like a bad idea. To just go I bet you, it's in there, the, though. It's in the temple. But where? Did, what if? What's his face is there? Well, no. Adelgrim. Adelgrim. Then we. This is like killing like eight birds with one stone. I have seen nothing wrong so far, other than a slight, you know, major injury and or death side effect. Sure, I guess. Also, I found a book on Genesis Champions. Uh, I can't read it. Allow me. Thank you. Yes, um, this one speaks of uh, Adelgrim, Brokard, Clodomir, Dufoot, Everard, Ferducus, Gainsborough. Uh, yeah, yes. in, in common, not Draconic. Come on. That, that was in common. <laughs> Gainsborough was his heiress' name. Yeah. That's too long of a name. Uh, they refer to him as Addy. Cute. Um, yes, it speaks of his time in the Dragon War as a as a hero, and then um, uh, all of the uh, atrocities he committed over the years uh, for Genesis, the wonderful. forbidden one. To the limit. <laughs> I caught that. He uh, murdered countless uh, dragonborn and dragon folk alike. He even killed an ancient dragon. And why didn't know? Oh, I feel like you know. 
You should have killed him after that. He was killed multiple times. Oh. He always just kept coming back. You gotta extra kill him. Is he the champion? Yes, a champion of Genesis. That's probably why he keeps coming back. Someone else eat these? They're awesome. <laughs> Myself. It also speaks of a um, mortal named Sanex. He used to be. Oh, uh, we kicked that guy. Or they, no, wait, was I there? I wasn't there. You weren't there. We killed him. He was. Well, you were, you've been there. You've, you've seen him. You saw so him. You killed him? Yeah, but he's trying to escape. Uh, Did you sever his connection to Genesis? How do you do that? We don't know how to do that. Well, there is a ritual for it. No. Uh oh. He's trying to come back. Oh, yeah. So. Show me the ritual. Uh, we do have a book on rituals here in. Uh, the forbidden section. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I'll no. just take that. And oh wait, I'll no. There was a, there was a the ritual. Road. Um, some cultists were actually trying to bring him back with this ritual. Yeah. Can I draw the circle from memory of what they had there? That sounds like a terrible idea. No, not here on a piece of paper, so I can show them what it looked like. Sure. Roll performance. They were trying to bring him back, but damn, someone threw a black dagger at him not while he was trying to come the out. The blade itself was black. Yeah. yeah. There's significance to that because? Uh, it has a powerful poison that if it touches a living being, they die. <laughs> I rolled that. I rolled it. And but you threw it into the realm between realms. Yeah. yeah. It wasn't it. us. It was... It was a companion of Arcee. Who is now so with Genesis. A, with Genesis. a dagger that instantly kills living beings was thrown at a currently dead being. Yes. Yes. In the realm between realms. Yes. We know. It's oh. not great. So what yeah. is that? What we, is that we, we know. It's terrible. It's a terrible thing. We, uh, we, Generally, we it has the opposite effect. Uh, if we're go if you were talking about the realm between realms, um, it, it probably has amplified his power. And if he isn't already back, he might be working on it. We knew that already. Yeah, but how we, we didn't know when we threw it. No, we learned after the fact because the broker told us. Oh, well, he yeah. would have came out if we didn't throw that dagger. Yeah. Anyway, I, I only roll the 12. So. The crude sketch. Pink. Oh, yes, this is the. They're gone. Oh, this is the <laughs> ritual of. Um, of acceleration. Um, because champions who die are put through a trial uh, in the realm between realms. It is called a trial of death. What if you're uh, already dead? That's just still to come back, I think. Oh. Champions are very difficult to kill, at least for long. They usually, um, it, it takes anywhere from a couple days to anywhere from that to a couple hundred years sometimes, depending on Gee, I hope Sanix just takes his sweet time. I'll just... It sounds like he's going to be done any second. The Ritual of Acceleration speeds up the process. Yeah, but we closed it. By throwing the knife at him and killing the cultists. Yeah, mom. Well... You may have only delayed it slightly, especially if you threw a blade that could empower a dead being in the realm between realms. Well, to be honest... The Does person... it have to be in the realm between realms? Or would like if I if he was here and we uh, would that would it work then? It would probably work, but it wouldn't sever his connection. It would have to use. Uh, he would have to perform a ritual in order to prevent him from ever coming back. There was someone who severed the connection between a champion and a god before. He had this like weird black goo on him. That is the after effects of severing connections from gods, especially if the if the champion has been alive for several several hundred years. Oh, that won't happen to me. I just realized that. <laughs> I won't have that side effect. My blood, my blood won't turn the icky black substance because I, I, my blood doesn't flow anyways. I can uh, try listen, that. Ekla found a loophole, I see. Ah, uh, yes. <laughs> You might be a even forever hard. champion. <laughs> it might be even harder to kill. 
Well, he's probably even back already. Who knows? What if I tried messaging him? How about no? <laughs> Hey, Sanix, what's up? <laughs> Long time no Hey, are you alive? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, he just said, let's not. Instead, Sanix just messages you, I lived, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> not, not, let's not knock on that door. Uh, I'm okay, back. fine. So, what's the ritual that would need to be done? It requires several things. The blood of the champion. An artifact of the of the god that they are bound to. An artifact. Mine would just be my brooch. And what is this? What is this ritual? And several hours of prep time. Well, that's pretty easy. Like it would take several hours, or we need to prep for several hours you beforehand. We need to prep for several hours beforehand, and then the process should be near instantaneous, if not take several hours afterwards. What would we need to do to prep? Well, you would need to bind all of these things to the artifact in question and stab them with it. We would need to bind blood, the blood of the champion. The blood of the champion. The And you would bind it to the artifact as well as some uh, sigils and runes that are detailed in this book here. And he... Um, he quickly copies it and hands it to you. Are the runes different for each champion, or are they just all? No, the same they are. Ones? They are all. Uh, they are all the same. It is. You a, want me to hold on to that? It is a simple, um, simple uh, god influence separation ritual. There any bag of holding? Well, yeah, because I'm best at drawing, so if I need to recreate this in a bigger sense. Sure. I'll take it. Mm -hmm. I'm going to learn the counter spell. All right. So, how many spells are you learning, and what levels? Yeah, you can learn a whole. You can learn. Oh, learn a whole. Okay. You know, you have Mister Miss Money Bags over there. Mm -hmm. Right. Okay, so I'm going to get <laughs> counter spell. What you think gold. it's for free? Huh? It takes gold and time. Yeah. Yeah. Does she have money? You have all the money. You have all the money. I currently have some money. I have some money, but you yeah. have all well, of it. Well, if you need more money. So that's 150. What, counter spell? Yeah. It, it's 50 per level. Yeah. Okay, so, and that was and, third level. So, and then, the, and then you're, are you, are you going to get tongues in Comprehend Languages? She doesn't need Comprehend Languages, she has tongues. I, comprehend Languages for written. Tongues is for speaking. Tongues is and, for and speaking. listening. So you need both. You need both. You could have both. You can have just one, or you can have both. Oh God! For each level of the spell, the process takes two hours. Two hours and fifty. And gold. fifty gold. Yep. Well, a six-level spell would take twelve, 12 hours. hours and six hundred gold. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'm not looking at six-level spells. You're not going to do flesh to stone. I want to. <laughs> we don't have. To, we're not going to be here for twelve hours. That means you could just learn it over a twelve-hour course. I got yeah. a six-level spell for you. I mean, the six-level spell I have is disintegrate. You know, good spell. It's a I great one. spell. It would have. It would have killed a, a, a thing, before. Right. It would have killed a, a vampire. A vampire. Wait, is it not Pythons? Or is this this one on here? <clears throat> so what spells are you learning? I'm I'm looking. What is the whole thing? Yeah, um, I'll probably do um, counter spell and tongues. Tongues, yeah. Let me look up tongues. Quick so I can have it on here. Because I think tongues is also a third level. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
It was under there. That one's one. Oh. Yes. There it is. Burning. Okay. Oh, I could have sworn there was one in here. It's so that's 300 gold total if you're doing the, both those third levels, and then it's going to take you six hours per spell. Mm-hmm. Damn. Yes, I know what you'll be doing tonight. <laughs> yeah, it takes forever. I mean, I don't need to learn that many spells right now, do I? <laughs> learn sending. Also, you can wait till you level up to learn flesh to stone. Yeah, I'm not gonna do flesh to stone. I'm just trying to find somewhat, somewhat lower. What about so, do you have 300 gold? I do have 300 gold. What about a cantrip? A new cantrip? I have 300 community goals. I don't think you can learn a cantrip. Um, or if you yeah. do, you, you literally learn it instantly. Because it's a level zero spell. So it takes no time and no gold. Cost 25 gold. Does it cost 25 gold? What is it? I'm blind. How did I miss this? And so if. Do you know how to get rid of a champion's power or connection to their to their god? Why did you guys never do it with Addy? They need his blood. I don't know. This is only something we've recently discovered. Oh. Since then, he has not been committing as many atroc atrocities. He's been in hiding. Please turn over a new leaf, I guess. No, no one said that. That is nice. I heard rumors that he was somewhere around here. Right. Around here? That he's been seeing Cal Cool. As recent as several months ago. Oh. <coughs> there would happen to be any old artifacts from times where uh, you guys have Bought him that happened to have his blood still, would you? Unfortunately, no. Yeah, it was a long shot. <laughs> Do you mean to kill him? Not necessarily. Depends on if he's part of the main cause of what's happening to. <laughs> In these lands. I mean, if we don't have to kill him, if we can just talk it out, maybe. I don't think talking it out will help. If he is allied with the Forbidden Three, then he might be. Well, we could convince him, probably. What happened the last time we tried to convince a champion of Genesis? Hmm. Did we? Exactly. Yeah. So. What are you guys doing? So are we going to the place you said the... Whatever it's called. Rook. I'm just gonna do those two for now. But we need a faster way to get there. Instead of... Uh, Razir then speaks up. Instead of going directly into Ruug, I would... Either suggest we head to Rus or Lisul. What's the difference? We're not going directly in. No, I mean between the two one, one's They're cold both. and one's a desert. Yes, one is cold and one is a desert. So it's down the desert. Lisul then. Which is which is the one where Onam was supposed to be at? The one where we're it, supposed to go is, first. Is it the blue dragons? Is it the right? We, weren't we, we were told like around where Onam was, weren't we? I think Onam and Raven the were in the same place. The, yeah, that's what the, happened. The ancient gold. Was it the ancient gold dragon that told us? 
or was it damn it this one it's, it's been a month i feel like it has been no um when like oscar the... was talking to phoenixia like in the actual oh was play, that, oh that's right that's what it was she mentioned about onam and the being somewhere yeah being somewhere i they... think it was in the place of the red dragons yeah with the red dragons or with raven that they're both in, in the place, same area. Yeah. I mean, you watched it. Yeah, it's like, it's like, I didn't watch the whole thing. I oh, darn. But yeah, I remember. It's the, it's, the, it's the place we're going to end up going anyway. Yeah, I remember uh, it's that. Around uh, Ruug. Yeah. That's Ruud. Ruud for the Ruud. Ah. Ha ha. Ha. Hee hee. Ho ho. Ho ho ho. Hee hee. What? <laughs> You're a king G. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot the name for when I was writing it down. Kazak? No. King. Oh. The dragon the gold, king. The gold, the gold dragon. It's Rondwin. King yeah. Chi? And I was like, king I didn't know. G. King G. Oh, king. I think you said kimchi. I don't know if you said kimchi like, also. No. I, was like, I was like, that's why I was like, Kazak? Sure, and I was sure. like, what the fuck? Is sure, sure, sure. King G. King G lets us stay the night. G. <laughs> <laughs> what a G. What a G. <laughs> that's what got me chuckling there. <laughs> and then I kind of just randomly added whatever I can remember right mm -hmm. now. All right, well, do we need any more information currently? Unless she wants to learn more spells. No, I'm just going to do those two. Is there a. What else is here in the forbidden section? <laughs> forbidden things. Is there a way to de-vampire somebody? No, I don't want that. <laughs> Bobby's made peace with this life. Yeah, of course. Bobby likes living forever. Especially now that he's learned that if his powers get taken away, he becomes goop. I don't be I won't become goop, most likely. Hmm. <laughs> I feel like there's something we're missing, but I can't remember right now, so I don't think there's anything left to do. I don't know. Time to just read every book. <laughs> They're all in Draconic. I can't read every book. Okay. So you guys are going to be heading to Lisur? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. No tomes of leadership and understanding. <laughs> I'll hand the books back to our our library guide. Thank you. I I do hope that you all would stay so that I can study you uh, a uh, little bit. Maybe I'll have to take if a you're not afraid of great bodily harm, you could come with us. Oh no, I. I am good not. in oh. my library. Afraid of great bodily harm. Got it. That's a that's a common fear. I do wish you could stay. Oh yeah, we got things to do. Yeah, we gotta save the continent or something, I guess. Well, then I will pray for your success to the harmonious one, and wish yeah. you good luck. Yeah, I'll be praying to her too. <laughs> Please let me lead you to the closest. Teleport gate. Yeah, see what happens when you're a nice god, people pray to you. <laughs> you feel like a, a slight pain in your back. <laughs> we need that. <laughs> the mommy. So he leads you to the teleport gate, and Razir says, closest I can get us to Ruug is in Fumbes. Okay, I don't. How close is? Wait, well, how close is that? Wait, yeah, I thought we were going to a for a, the other place. The Sul? Yeah. Yes, it's the the realm is the Sul. Oh, saying... the capital city is Tumpes. Yeah, he's just saying... I was confused. I thought it was a whole ass city. No, the Sul is the Blue Dragon realm. What? 
Oh, wait. Was Souls the blue dragon room? Yes. Okay. They live in the desert? An interesting choice. What can I say? I live in prison, so my choice, <laughs> you know, I, what do I know about living situations? And Razier slaps his hand on the, on the teleport gate and says, Boom Bess. And the teleport gate roars to life. All right. Do you all walk through? Yep. Time to go. No, we skip through. As much as it pains me, yes. I will leave this treasure trove. <laughs> There's a lot of good shit here, but uh, can't learn anything. I feel like we learned a lot. I'll come back later, I promise. I don't know what and I before my you go, next to this teleport gate, you spy a 20-foot tall dragonborn. Oh, is that the sapphire? A sapphire dragonborn just looking as you are about to enter into the teleport gate. Did anyone else say this is a bit concerning? Is anyone going to say anything? Uh, does, oh, does it I, say anything? Do you look at it directly in the eyes? No. Oh, no. no you no, fool. You looked at it in the eyes. Why would I look in the you eyes? You looked into my eyes, and now it has sealed your doom. Oh, time to go on a ride that breaks down all the time. It would hurt my neck having to look up it's that high. It's old, okay. Yeah, I know. It's a great ride, though. Do I look in her eyes? Fuck. <laughs> Just don't. Is that my dice? Yes. Doesn't roll up. So you look her directly in the eyes? Sure. You see the deepest of blue eyes that extend, seem to extend out as far as the sea. And you feel a warmth. Something you haven't felt in a long time. Yeah, I'm not used to this. I'm turn around and Bob is going to be on fire. And she <laughs> smiles. And nods. All right, toodaloo. <laughs> Bob, are you talking to? The tall one. Big woman. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's go. And you enter through the portal and you immediately feel the heat rush. I'm right at home. As you are now oh, no, in the capital desert. city I can shave you. of Tumpes. <sighs> you all saw the big one, right? What? Mm -hmm. No. I mean, they're kind of hard to miss. You, saw you looked into the great, great librarian's eyes. Oh, that was the great librarian? I mean, I guess I suppose that makes sense. It was very tall. And you live? Yeah, they just... They're very blue and beautiful. Please speak no more. Could she just kill you by looking in your eyes? That's fucked up. Is that a rumor or something somebody started? No one is to look her in the eyes. But Why? she smiled at me. I am surprised that you live. Oh, I mean, she's not my type, but she smiled at me. <laughs> How dare you? She's definitely my type. Your type is alive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Wait, that's, that's not true. Isn't that your no, type? No, that's, uh, that's, that's no, that Bobby. Is, that is very much true because <laughs> Bobby doesn't have a pulse. Exactly. <laughs> we would have banged not already. Bobby, not Bobby. That's Bobby's type. No, my type is... Anything with a pulse? No. That, anything with that, blood. That, anything with questionable morals and likes pain. Yeah, anything with blood is his, Shit. Is his dinner. I know you're just describing me. <laughs> I know who I'm describing. <laughs> 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 what time is it? It's hot o'clock. <laughs> it's always hot o'clock. We're in the desert. No, it gets cold in the desert at night. You should know this. You're from a desert. Yeah. Yeah, it's really hot. So, uh, uh, and as you uh, look out across the city, the uh, the sandstone architecture. Um, all over uh stretches high into the sky um 
casting a little bit of a shade as you as you enter in to at least save you a little bit from this uh, disgusting heat. Um, wow. and I know there are, are there are blue dragonborn a, walking yeah. <laughs> walking all over uh, with uh, with um, <laughs> blue kobolds scurrying around, and then there are blue dragonborn children running around. And one of the dragonborn children is holding um, a scroll, and uh, he just reads out, And it seems like he's a, like a crier of some type, just reading this? off news. What yeah. is he, what, what, what's the news? What's he saying? Did he just announce us? No, I don't think so. That'd be Run. convenient. That would be fast. The news works fast here. Um, we just got here. He he said, uh, uh, this n- now new in uh, Tumpes, um, strange creatures seen in uh, in Verdu, uh, Verdu forests. This ain't no forest. Wait, was that where we were? No. no. Where is this Verdu forest? It's on the oh, other sir. side. Verdu is uh, the green dragon realm. Maybe they just got confused with. Uh, is, is there, we got too many things to do. Is with. there a description of these strange creatures? No, it's the news. It's just gonna say strange creatures. It doesn't seem that he gives a description. All right, could be anything. Also, just realized it's actually hotter here than it would be in the normal our normal desert. Yeah, it is hotter. It is hotter maybe. because you're closer to the we're sun. closer to the sun, yeah. and above the clouds. Someone pushed the earth further away. So maybe put on your hat. My bard hat. Or your 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 nice tanned skin will not be tanned. I'm not gonna You guys think I'm immune to sunburn? And there looks to be a um, <laughs> actually everybody wrote me perspective. Oh, sunburn. <laughs> I definitely <laughs> am your pale ass skin. Fuck, I gave my cloak away. I can't put my hood up anymore. I have a cloak. Yeah, you have my you cloak. Have the cloak. Yeah. Well, that was a four, so nineteen. <laughs> Wait, what'd you say? Perception. 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 Fourteen. Okay. Twenty-two. Twenty-two. Okay. okay. And you got like a four? Well, no, yeah, yeah but it's a nineteen. Oh, okay. <laughs> Reliable talent. That's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you all notice there's like uh, a messed up looking blue dragonborn just running around going. Boombas, boombas, boombas. Like, like he's fucked up. No, just he's just running around. He, just, he just looks crazy. What is he saying? It's crazy, he's, Joe. He's happy to. He's he's saying where he's at. He's happy to be here. He must love this place a lot. Hey, you with the boombas. Yeah, you. Is that crazy, Joe? Iba the soul. Don't see me. There's one here what? too? Yeah, why does he remember Iba me too, crazy Joe? I can't even escape him in the sky? What is he saying? Even a summoner too. Yeah, he, someone, tell, someone tell me what he's saying. Uh, he's uh, he's asking what what are we doing here and why do we look not like Dragonborn? Because we're, uh, we're not Dragonborn. We're here to save everyone. Wait, not not like that. Um, we're here to, I don't know. We want do we want to talk to the king of the blue dragons or queen? I mean, that sounds like fun. Well, yeah, I mean, why? All right, I'll just relay all that. Well, you don't have to not relay that exactly. part. You can just say we're not Dragonborn. I mean, it, not that that wasn't obvious. And then it's none of his business. He looks crazy. You can say that part, too. I don't mind. Joe. <laughs> so Heather relays all that, and he goes, But a CP. Oh. <laughs> Jabba the Chuda. Huh? All right, Jabba. <laughs> What's he saying? Ah, <laughs> so oh, 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 oh. Hey, listen, there's different dialects. Like Sonic, okay? did, did Crazy Joe sell his wares up here, and then they're all like, this guy's cracked out on Crazy Joe specials? <laughs> and, and Crazy Joe juice? Did you know the juices just make everyone Crazy Joe? Sibir and Nupa, What's he saying? I just know he said that. He said that he's, he's the king of Tumpes. Oh, the king. Turn to the art dragon board, <laughs> yeah. There's no fucking way, right? <laughs> no. I, yeah, definitely I didn't, not. I didn't think so. Wait. Oh. Wait, he, wait, this could be interesting. What in the nicho? Huh? Or what is he offering now? Because that sounded like he was offering me something. 
he said, do you want to come with him to his castle? Yeah. I do want to know where his castle is, actually. <laughs> I, w- I don't I don't trust him. I listen. He just, he just yells out, "Do this!" Not about to just commit a crime in the middle of the street. You guys want to go to his castle? Dragonborns. No, we shouldn't. I'm surprised the name of this place hasn't hit you guys yet. Don't pass. Tupac. <laughs> yes. Think of lightning and dragons. And Tempest. Tempest. Yes. <laughs> I didn't say Tupac. <laughs> that was our second choice. Oh my god, I've been waiting so long to finally drop this. And it's just like, I'm just like screaming it. I'm just like, like, please get it. I, I mean, I got it immediately. I just wasn't going to say anything. He never does. Anyway, you guys want to see his castle? He's going to take really. us to some fucking shack outside. I mean, does he know what the, this the king looks like? Behind the bar. He said he's the king. I know, but can I ask the dragon more, dragon more friend? Do you know what the king looks like here? Not like that. He's an actual ancient dragon. Yeah. That's good if he's an ancient dragon. Obviously, Shouldn't, he's not. Isn't that, like, offensive to, like, claim you're the dragon king when you clearly aren't? Yes, of course it is, but just that, ask him. On the transformer something. Is that against the law? They got laws here? I hope not. That's up. Oh, so. Sibas and not. Boom, bass. He claims he is an ancient dragon. Tell him if he is, he can prove it. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why you're I'm curious. giving him the time of day. I give a lot of people the time of day. He likes to Now, them. now, we can't be rude to the locals. Am I useful for something? This one you can. <laughs> and he goes, that was Koro Asito. Ibana. Oh, Orasa. What was that, Mufasa? Did he just raise up his arms to pretend they were wings? Yes. All right, okay, let's go now. I'm leaving. Yeah. <laughs> I said we were wasting our time. I was just having some entertainment. I'll, I'll, I'll clap to have, like, oh, the most so annoyed. Uneby. The most, so an, the most oh. annoyed face ever. He wouldn't notice anyway. Whatever, let's go where the actual king would be. I flip him a gold coin. Why? Use the toss a coin. Because game. it was like a performance. He catches it. Oh, so bonibi. Mm-hmm. But he just puts it in his satchel and he just runs away. That's what rich people do. They yeah. just give poor people money. Uh, the poor uh, king of the blue dragons is uh, much worse off than apparently thought. Well, like he's a Sing- single benevolent king who gives his who gives his hoard away. You ever heard of a dragon giving shit away? That's what I thought. Look, I got him to leave. I ain't actually. Ne- I'm just making shit up. But anyway, you guys got hordes, right? Like that's a that's a thing dragons do. Uh, yes, that is a thing that yeah. they do. They, they never give stuff away from the hoard. Walk and talk. So before we meet the king, what are we gonna ask? Hey, uh, don't kill us, please, and tell your people not to kill us, too. We're gonna that's... go investigate some Genesis shit. We're just passing through. I, I guess that's asking. Right? That's why we're here. We're just passing through. Pretty much. Yeah. So just, Yes, just... we are on our way to Ru'ug. Yep. Tell him we're gonna go to Ru'ug, and if he ain't got any sway with the Red Dragons, tell him not to kill us, too. That'd be nice. Yeah. That would be Flash the, the the thing and show him chest and we're good. If I know Volt Ur, then um, he uh, he does have uh, some sway with Boom Soon. Sure. I mean, good. Maybe we won't get torched. And by me, I mean we. I mean you. Three, four, five. Six. Six. Oh, I'm sorry, Arnold. I forget you exist. I'm already playing into the class system. I'm sorry. 
I was just like, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, you were four! What do you mean? One, two, three, four, five. five. Oh. Six with Arnold. Yeah. But still, you were lower. But there's seven of you. Who did we... Who? He you forgot him. to count yourself. Yeah, yeah I'll dodge could... the dragon flame. What do you mean? Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I said you guys. Ah, oh, that's right. I have a patient. <laughs> anyway... I have Peter, I'll just fly away. It'll catch you. He'll make me a Peter, it, uh, roast Peter. It will catch you. It will catch you. Roasted, uh, It flies faster than your Pegasus. Roasted Pete. Maybe not with haste. No, not with haste. Not with haste. I'm gonna go like, haste! Do you think a dragon can't cast haste on itself? I don't know, maybe! <laughs> and then it's, air, it's a jet plane. It, it's a... Uh, no, going, it's, at that point, it's a B-52 bomber. It's, it's, going, it's, 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 it's a bagel it's, goose. It's the Valstrax. It's going, it's going mock speed. It's, it's like a, a bagel goose at that two. point. It's going Koro Sensei speed. That's okay. Mach 20. Never mind. <laughs> you can go around the world and... Uh, well, Flash, how fast can Flash go? Uh, light. Okay, well... <laughs> Yes. Depending on which depending on which flash, the answer is light speed. That seems dangerous. Can't you just go into the past or future? Because you go. That's what he does. That's that's, 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 that's the that's whole flash point. point. Oh, mm -hmm. that seems dangerous. Yeah, By the way, Flash movie sucked balls. How do you know? Of course they it don't did. make good movies. They only make good. Uh, they only TV make shows. good Batman movies. Yeah. Yeah. And then the, and everything and then else like, is the TV shows. But that even then, that's still questionable Flash sometimes. DC, right? Yeah, animated movies. Marvel makes all the good movies. Well, it's because the animated movies are like a whole. Except for Batman vs Superman, but Batman vs Superman is awful. Yeah, it's not a Batman movie. It's a Superman movie. That's why it was garbage. Mm -hmm. But anyways, so you guys are gonna go meet with uh, with Volt Ur. Yes, the King. Volt -Ur. <laughs> King of the Blue Dragons. Bold hair. <laughs> and as you are heading to the the uh, Blue Sandstone Castle, that's that is where we're going to take a break. We'll be back in just a little bit. Don't go too far away. See you guys soon. Uh, yeah. We're learning so much. Yeah, so much lore dump. Yeah. Um, yes. Uh. Anyways, we'll see you guys in a bit. Bye. How to make the new Dragon Ball Mythic in Fortnite 10 times stronger. So we all know the Kamiya Mama. Just, just take it out. Take it out of Fortnite. They don't, they don't deserve it. No, that, this is the last one. I can't. Potatoes. You can practically neglect them and they'll still grow. Is that why I'm so fucking fat? Worcestershire. Worcester says a fuck! Have you ever felt like you've had no energy like this guy? Who? Me? Yeah, you. You uh, should try Rogue Energy. What's Rogue Energy? Well, Rogue Energy is a new supplement that gives you all the energy you need with all the great flavors and no calories and no sugar. And it's easy to make, too. All you need is a 16 ounce glass of water, a scoop of your favorite flavor of Rogue Energy, and then the final step, shake it. Keep shaking. Ultra shake. Hyper shake. Shake it all the way! And now you can try it for yourself. Wow! Don't forget to use promo code Smoking Dragons at checkout for 10% off your order. Get your rogue today. Now in a can! Hi, I'm Nova, and I bet you're tired of seeing me in this chair. That's why I'm here to talk to you about our Patreon. Our Patreon did just recently get a facelift, so while sitting my ass in this chair, we're gonna talk about it. Our D4 tier is the general basic support and gives you access to our exclusive behind the scenes podcast, The Dragon's Lair. The D6 tier unlocks the ability to watch more exclusive content. We'll talk about that in a bit. The D8 tier gives you VIP status in both our Discord and our Twitch live streams, which come with their own perks. The D10 tier allows you to bring a character with your name attached to it into our D&D campaign. Also, from the D6 tier and up, you will have access to our exclusive D&D campaign, Pocket Adventures, an adventure that sees four children trying to be the very best, like no one ever was. An exciting, nostalgic campaign that sees me finally get my ass out of the seat. 
I've been sitting here so long that it has begun to form fit to the shape of my ass, and it has lost all cushion. So please, join our Patreon and help contribute to me getting my ass out of this seat. Join our Patreon by going to the link on your screen or by clicking the link in the description below. Thank you. We challenge you as sister and brother. Couple, Cam and Allie. Um, boom, boom, bam, out, da, don't, don't, da, out, and big wheels keep on turning. I hate you so much. <laughs> yes, bitch. Yes, bitch. Do the Donald Trump. Like you're sucking a dick. No. Taking all the dicks. My signature move. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get a critical capture at least once? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! You think I go behind him? You're gonna. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you see? Rico, what did your elven eye see? Fucking let me know. You looked around it. You saw uh, I'm fucking dead. What's back there? <laughs> Looking for some dead stuff, baby, this evening. I make some dead stuff, baby, tonight. I want some dead stuff, baby, this evening. Gonna make some dead stuff. Philippe Pinnis. Must be Rico. Oh, what? <laughs> I had to watch that on the stream. Oh, that was great. Oh my god. Wait, door. Please, for the no! last of my question. If I were, if I... I'm sure the mic peaked. I'm sure it did. There's no way it didn't. Oh, we, we definitely went ham on a couple parts right there, but, um, uh, just use mic responsibility. There's another term for it, but if you're gonna if you're gonna go loud, yeah, that's pull why. It back. I, that's why I pulled out. Yeah. Aha, amazing. Uh, I'm sitting here doing this, and you're just like, that's why I pulled out. All our power was put into this. Here I go. Taste the passion in my ball. Butterfly, please leave me alone. I ain't dealing with your shit right now. Do 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 do. I'm trying to catch more picks so that I can give one quish. And so I'm gonna catch them all. And maybe one will be shiny. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Shiny hunt on smoking dragons. Are you sure you don't want me to stop no, no, no. and restart? No, no, no. Got this. Okay, I, I get two more tries. It went this way. <laughs> it went straight back down. It's like, I'm gonna get you. <laughs> that was unfair. I'm coming you saw, get you. You saw it bounce sideways and it just turned right back the fuck around. <laughs> That's how physics works. Right? Super heat track and rock. No! And welcome back. The others are getting over here and finishing their food. They are indisposed. You picked a small bowl. <clears throat> I did. I, I, did you not hear the part where I said I regret my bowl I, choice? I didn't know why. I regret my bowl choice. Huh? Ah, uh, salt. Yeah, they're salty. Well, it's good. They're good because they're salty. Yeah. But they are a bit over salty. But that's just the brand. So. You all are heading into the blue stone, sandstone castle. Quite blue. <clears throat> I like the other purple place better. Mash my eyes better. I think I would like the rice, but I like them. So, as you uh, walk up the steps, two blue dragonborn. A boss. Show them your thing. What? Oh, they're not gonna let us in. You think just I don't think this and saying that means welcome in. 
he he they point back Ross. I think they said turn around. I mean, show me your fucking amulet. Hey, how about the one who one of the ones who speaks Draconic? Tell him. Yeah, Razir. Why are you like this? How about your Siba? Iba Sora, Bolt Ur, Iba Sora, Motulis, for so. Sora and Iba. Motulis, Siba, so. Sora. Iba Sora. Bobby C. Iba Tora. Bobby C. For BC. We shall see. <laughs> he looks at you. <laughs> what? He's me some moron. So, so what's he evil? Yeah, he. He was more to least he was so. Abato. Now you say moron? Nice. Rose. What? Walk in. They motion for you to come in. That's what I thought. If you guys like my 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 draconic. No, it's very scary. Oh, okay. Good, that was the point. I don't know what they're saying, so it's working. It's effective. Can you roll a performance roll, please? Can I see how well you did? Well, ah, it's okay. My, mod- my my charisma modifier, though, I have a plus three in charisma myself. Uh huh. So, I suppose I am proficient in performance as well. So, that makes it like a, a slutty 20. Hey. Okay, well. <clears throat> so, as you guys walk through the uh, the halls of uh, tapestries of uh, lightning storms uh, are uh, are hung across uh, hung across the walls. I'm laughing for something it, it, entirely something. different. It's just the way you said lightning reminded me of it. Lightning and shit. <laughs> We'll be quiet. It's just so you um you walk through the halls. Hey, and I think these dragons like lightning guys. They are. That is their element that they breathe. Oh, sick! You shoot lightning out of their mouths. Yes, that's <clears throat> that is hardcore. Probably they thought of like ever shutting up. Not while I'm awake. <laughs> <laughs> so does that mean never? Thanks, Deadpool. I have to sleep. <laughs> Thanks, Butcher Deadpool. <laughs> Great value, Deadpool. <laughs> <laughs> no it's discount, still, Deadpool. It's still Ryan Reynolds, so it's not even discount. Is it, it's not Dollar Store Deadpool. <laughs> it's not Dollar Tree Deadpool. Ninety nine cents. Ninety nine cent plus Deadpool. Five below Deadpool. Five below Five Deadpool. Below Deadpool. Now it's ninety nine cent plus because not ninety nine cents it's, anymore. Yeah, certain things are ninety nine cents. Everything else is. Not even, not even everything at the Dollar Tree is a dollar. Yeah, it's, it's it, like a dollar five. Stuff used to be, and then COVID fucked everything. Mm. The human race fucked everything. Isn't that what they do? Yeah. That is what we mortals do. So you continue down the halls, um, and a lot of this, uh, the furniture and stuff around is made out of sandstone um, and marble. As you... Uh, walk through to a grand atrium. An atrium. A room? Big room. Isn't that something in your heart? That is a not an atrium. What? What is it called? Or is it aorta? Well, that's just aorta that's atrial just a... fibrillation yeah. is aphid when your heart's pretty much a heart attack. Close, but no cigar. What about A-Train? That's... A-Train, that's a guy in the... That's, that's the, the hero from... Who is uh, also a, a dirty, dirt douchebag. He got redemption. Kinda, yeah. Uh, uh, 
<laughs> he still he still ran through a lady and tried to deny it. Yeah, yeah, but, then he, but then he ran through that one guy. And That's the first him. episode. That was his. For one. anybody who's never That's seen the it. first five That's minutes. Exactly. Yeah, <laughs> that was literally the they first. They killed Jamie's girlfriend real quick. Running through it. Yeah. Well, I think it was season. I didn't. Know. Well, I know. they have the. The prequel. Gen V one. Yeah. Oh, I wasn't. I don't really think it's, is it really a prequel or is it just like oh. within it's the. It's in the same universe. Yeah, because I, I don't know like, what. Time. If I'm going to watch anything, I'm going to watch it. <clears throat> yes, till next year. I haven't watched it. Anyway. So. This um, is cursed. Never mind. You, uh, <laughs> you walk into this, uh, grand atrium and, um, a giant blue dragon soars in. See how hot this one is? And. <laughs> he forms into his uh, his humanoid form, which is uh, he has long blonde hair with blue uh, accents at the tips of the hair, um, with piercing dark blue eyes um, and pointed <laughs> ears. He looks like an elf. They should like to take elf and tell him from. Well, they are the long Everyone lived race. Everyone get on your knees. Everyone bow. Yeah, it doesn't take much for you to get on And as he stands, <laughs> lightning and thunder begin to crash. Lightning and shit. I didn't like that. Hello. Your grace, it's an honor. You are the mortals I've been hearing about. Yes. We are that, mortals. I mean, there's, that there's other depends on what you've heard yeah. about us. <laughs> it all depends on what you've heard. Good things, yes. Bad things, no. Well, we were no. going to meet, but it's a shame. I know there's been uh, things and... going on. Yes. Many disasters are occurring across Solaris. Yeah, we were kind of there. We... Amacelia, they were being attacked when we left. We escaped right before... Everything went crashing. The amethyst dragons have already fallen. Probably. Perhaps. No, I'm telling He's you. He's stating oh, the fact. No, oh, it sounds like a question. I okay. Shivala's corruption runs deep. It only took mere moments. Queen Amethelia may very well be dead. Do you think they would stop with this continent? They wouldn't, do you th or do you think they would care to? Their goal is to reach Ha'amun and unseat the Harmonious One from her place. Well, I can't let that happen. Yeah, not good for you. We appreciate your dedication. However, this should be left to dragon kind. Well, with all due have... respect, as Phoenixia's champion, I have a duty to do something about it. He raises his eyebrow. You are the champion of the Harmonious One. I am. Does he raise it? <laughs> what? <laughs> Does he raise it like the rock? No. Is that what you said? That's what it's you just said. now processed that you he said. Does he also shake it like the rock? Does he smell what the rock is cooking? <laughs> Sorry, I can help my. I mean, if you doubt me, and I'll like unbutton my shirt and show my mark. I see. Perhaps we could grant you access to Ha'amun. It is forbidden even to most dragon kind. I was there already, it's spiritually. Is that where you go? Well, that was only this time because it's oh. so close to where Phoenixia's temple was. That, uh... mm. But, I mean, how do we stop them? They're, they're God. Is there any way to seal them? <clears throat> we have rituals prepared. <laughs> However, we believe that is only a temporary solution. Well, we were going to head over to where the red dragons were. If you can maybe have them not kill us, that would be... I mean, a temporary well, solution is better than no solution. I can speak with Kroom soon. Uh, he is not happy currently. The last mortals that were here. He, uh... What did they do? 
Those, the, they're really putting a bad rap for the rest of us. I know. Well, first of all, they didn't return the library book. That's already strike one. <laughs> there was an attack. <laughs> the worst crime committed. There was attack against the red dragons. From these humans? We know not where it started. Krumsung has not given us all the details, which makes me think he just is a Having a tiff with his old flame. Oh. Like, like relationship? <clears throat> yes. Eh. Messy. Well, yeah, we're searching for one of these humans in that group, and then another one who was taken by a red dragon that had a medallion. The halfling. You know of him? Yes, I was there when Krum Su questioned him. What became of him? I do not know. What about the medallion? As far as I know, it was returned to the Sapphire Dragons. Well, they don't have it. Then the amulet is lost. Right. That's what they said. Yeah, we're working on that. <laughs> <sighs> Boy, would I wish it to be found. So... If only things were as simple as wishing for them. I mean, I don't have wish. <laughs> Not yet. I feel like this ancient dragon would absolutely have wish. But still can't wish for it. <laughs> I wish to have all Genesis parts. That's no. Then, not I, Genesis parts. I, no, I, no. I have to be specific because if I don't, then I'm going to have them all bound. <laughs> you're you're, you're going to get Genesis parts. <laughs> I wish what? to have all be a new vessel. Oh, <laughs> oh, dude, imagine if one person having all the things of Genesis. You'd pretty much be unstoppable. Oh, man. It's almost like we you'd be Genesis. Who's working on that. Yeah, but he doesn't want to use them. I will attempt to <clears throat> converse with Krum Sung. He's not been open to communication. Well, I appreciate it. Um, but also the temple. How long do you think we have? If stories of what is happening in Verdu are to be treated as fact, we may already be seeing the fall of the chromatic realms. Well, I can't let that happen. Not all of them. Or if the Forbidden Three were to take Solaris and to unseat Phoenixia from her place, the continent will fall. Yeah. Like literally? <laughs> yes. Oh, like shit. literally. That's less good. We don't want that to happen. Yeah, it's I mean, it kind of became my business now. As well as causing untold destruction to the land, you will then have to deal with a second dragon war. Love the fuck. Well, then we can't let that happen. Let's stop that. Yeah. Well, so what did this last group even do when they were here? I don't know of their... Seems like a whole lot of nothing is what I'm looking at here. I don't know of their... Uh... Escapades. Who? Oh, can they know. committed a war crime by not returning the library book? <laughs> it all started with the library book, and then it just went downhill from there. I'm sure, not returning a library book isn't the. I know. I, mean, I am no. making a joke, but I mean, it seems like after a this group left, joke. Oh, you guys don't. They're not no, joking, we, people. Aren't. It's like sarcasm. It's like you say something that sarcasm. Yeah, you say something that um. Something like that you, will make you, you laugh. No, you say something that you know that is... Opposite of what you mean, but yeah. you say it in a way so that people understand that you mean the opposite. Is Inflection in your voice matters a lot. Mortals are confusing. We are. But it seems like after this group left, all of a sudden all this stuff is happening, coincidentally. Is this a coincidence, or did they so do it's something? All their fault? Well, it all started happening when we got here. Well, so yeah. maybe it's us. Well, how long ago did... the last time these humans were seen. We are not sure. There are conflicting reports. So, like, like, what? Some people say they saw them recently, but not anywhere in these lands. Well, I had communication with one of them, what, a few months ago? I saw them not. Yeah, a few months ago, I talked to one of them, and they were on their way up here, so... 
It's not like shit would have happened the last couple months. Regardless, they're probably not here anymore. I guess there's been reports of them seeing them not here on this continent. We heard reports from the black dragons that there were what? mortals that came to visit. How long ago was that? Several days. They're probably That's still really on the recently. continent. They're probably still... Did they give a description of these mortals? Did anyone look like this? Yes, that is one of the mortals. Then why wasn't I able to communicate with him? We've been here a day. He rejected your call. That's fair. I haven't tried talking to him again. We've also only been here a day. Oh, oh yeah. Well, between, two days. Well, oh yeah, two days. So between, they could have something could have happened between then. That's true. <clears throat> when did I try to start communicating with him when we got here? When we got here, you immediately tried to communicate with him. Yes. It didn't work. No. Or he'd have died in those couple of days. Or went to a distant plane. Is there a way for people to get into the uh, this realm between realms or whatever? The realm between well, realms. The only way I know of being able to get there is through a god's influence or death. What if they went there to get rid of Sanix? Is it possible to stop from what, someone from doing their trials? To interfere? You speak of the trials of death. Yes, when a champion's trying to come back. I suppose it is possible, but the realm between realms already is designed that way. So it makes it a trial. Well, if people were alive to go into the realm between realms, you said it only would by a god's influence. The god's influence sent them there, then they could, in fact, delay any champion's revival. Hmm. That's a possibility. I'd like to delay the fall of this continent. Yeah, we don't want it to fall. So I guess literally, I guess we can try going to the. Uh... Are you saying that the answer to this lies in the realm between realms? Possibly. I don't know. Well, but... I tried communicating with my companion. Um, I couldn't, which means they're either dead or not on this plane. Secondly, when uh we fought, we Sanix was coming back through a ritual with the that the cult was trying to do to speed it up. We closed the portal, but not before we. Um, my companion threw a black dagger at somebody that's supposed to kill someone that's dead, different or companion. alive. But since he was dead, I think all it did was make him stronger. So if they went to deal with Sanex because he was going to come back, they could be in the realm between realms. Maybe if I go to the Church of Phoenixia, maybe she can allow us passage there. That could also have nothing to do with what's actually happening in Solaris too. Yeah. In order to grant you access to Ha Moon, I would need to speak with. Um, Soong and also King Glondwin. Yeah, well, we, we visited. Uh, I would I would also include Queen Amathelia in that, but she may she... likely be dead. Yeah. The three leaders of the dragons need to <laughs> confer in order to grant access to Ha Amun, as oh. it is sacred and holy ground. Yeah. What's, what's well, we came name? from originally. Uh, our dragonborn friend. Luzir. Luzir. Well, Can you speak for King Glondwin or something? I don't know. <laughs> I was sent by King Glondwin to assist them in anything that they need, so you have King Glondwin's permission. The red dragon might be more difficult since you said he wasn't really in the communicating kind of mood lately. Rumsung is angry, to say the least. At... The other mortals. mortals? Well, if you let him know that I'm Phoenixia's champion, maybe he'll sign it up. That make him more of that. Yeah, because mm. weren't the red that dragons. Phoenixia's champion is immortal. Yeah. Yeah, but respect Phoenixia's wishes. It's yeah, what she wanted. Aren't the red dragons not. I don't know if any love with red dragon. Phoenixia? Aren't they. All no, the dragons. Are... So the dragons are... They all forsook. Uh, their previous gods that they were now it's coming to bite them in the ah, ass. Okay, gotcha. I mean, that's, gonna... that's the reason why this, this is, happening. is happening. I mean, gotcha. We're going there first, and then we're gonna go to the temple. Oh, so this is all Phoenixia's fault? No, it's all the humans' fault. Technically, actually. I mean, technically. Technically, yeah. Technically, yeah, you're not wrong. Technically, it's the dragon's fault. Yeah, for working <laughs> fucking shitty gods in the first place. <laughs> yeah. 
pick better gods for him. Although you'd feel like the god of the the god of betrayal wouldn't mind because it's the god of betrayal. You can't betray the god of betrayal. The god of betrayal betrays you. I mean, what yeah. do you expect from the god of betrayal? She appreciates betrayal unless you're betraying her. <laughs> it's a double standard. Goddamn gods. I got a double standard over here too. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> you get whipped. Anyway. Please. You are guests in my palace. I shall have a talk with Kroom soon, and we'll see about granting you access to Ha'amon. I know it's poor timing, but hopefully he can understand the situation. Hopefully. Does this mean we're not going to go to Genesis' temple? We're going there first. That's in the... Where You're the... heading to the temple of Genesis yourself? Where is that again? Rook. Which is on our... The red dragon, the red dragon. Yeah, well, that's why we're why is there... Apparently it's been active for the last two months. Hmm. Which might have something to do with what's going on. Perhaps... Adelgrim is a part of this. That's who we're also yeah. trying to track down. That's also probably where all the this land's destruction will start from. So it looks like everything's pointing to... You can use any of our teleport gates. You just need to speak the words. Do these gates look like the ones in House of Hope? Hmm? The teleport gates, they look like the ones in House of Hope? In Baldur's Gate? Kind of, yeah. I wish you could have gone. Yeah, in so many places. I know. One day. Never. Yeah, the game's not going to get an update. That's yeah, true. Or I mean, DLC. Maybe update, not DLC, no. Maybe for free content added, please. More races. Just, ASMR gotta, is the number one, like... You, you just gotta wait for the mods. Not all the races are campaign, on there. Campaign no. mods. No, they only have... Like they don't even have all the classes. They don't have Artificer. They don't have um, a lot of subclasses. They have, they have the, the base game. Base There's classes. a lot of mods, though, that people did for, like, like they're really good. Like the Artificer mod and the Blood Hunter. And Bard, the other Bard class, the College of Glamour, I think, and the other Druid. Yeah, because when what's uh, Chris was playing, I was like, that doesn't look. All the all the lists that he was going through, what class to choose him and everything. I was yeah, like, oh, there's, oh there's another really big wish for yeah. was Aladrin. To be added, just yeah. Dark Hire. It could have gone for Shadark. So, um, <clears throat> you just have to <laughs> speak the words. Genesis Tumbel. <laughs> That's what Razir is here for, right, Razir? Genesis Tumbel. 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 Genesis. Genesis Temple. It's Genesis Temple. <laughs> this is a really hard word to learn. I'm just kind of. Genesis Tumbel. Tumbel. What? Tumbel. Tum. Genesis Tumbel. Like a tomb. Okay. Yeah. yeah. We'll just have Razir do it. Uh, I'll take care of it. Thanks. It's your native tongue, I'm sure. Well, I shall go and speak with Kroom soon. Thank you, Your Grace. Alice is open to you when you return. Thank you. So we're going to the temple first. Well, well before, we before we go, uh, we should probably think about how we're going to deal with Adelgrim, if he's there. I'm gonna talk to him first. When has that ever worked? I haven't tried! No, as in, like, talking to anybody that we were trying to, like, stop. Look at what happened with the broker! He's our fucking ally now! The broker... That's true. That's true. the one time where it's That's worked. That's the one time it's worked. <laughs> yeah, and I'm gonna try one it, and like then back in time we just kill them. And then do that weird ritual thing. To be fair, in Moiraine's case, the one other time that she tried, uh... <laughs> It was, you Another know, one champion. of her one of her closest friends. Yeah, and well, he was didn't even give a fuck. That's why I'm like, I mean, maybe what? maybe we can. I I said that's the first thing, and then backup will kill them. So. I don't even know why we're trying to talk to him. He sounds like a douchebag. It's just well because it's we don't have to fight. I him. personally don't feel like fighting a man who is two thousand years old. Yeah, me neither. So yeah, I mean, we did fight Xanax. I don't know. Uh, Xanax is five hundred years old. That's true. Yeah. That's like quadruple. quadruple. That's like a. 
Okay, Why like I said, we no. can, I can try to talk it out first. Like, hey, listen, Alvin. I feel like listen. we should have an exit strategy. We should. But we have to take care of them somehow. And if the the second part involves killing them, we well, yeah. can also have this stuff will ever stop. Yeah, and we can sever their connection to their god with that thing. Why do you think we learned it? For this reason. Don't be a bitch. True, but then we have to make sure we stay alive. Oh man. How many times have we try to stay alive and we're fine? It's fine. I mean, how many times have I died? I'm really I'm, hard to kill. I'm so, so it's I'm fine. so sorry At that least two of you I don't up. have the ability to come back to life after I well, die. They, they, no one says they can't sever my connection to my god if they know how to do that. Maybe you should pray to a god harder. Yeah. Isn't there a god like the one who was involuntarily chosen to be? Yeah, now he's riding with it. Yeah. He was voluntold. Yeah, I was praying really hard to get out, not specifically to anybody. Anyway, like I said. And here I am, not in jail. Do you Forever not agree grateful. that we need to take care of him somehow? I mean, that was the whole point. So maybe we should start praying to mine, Lifalna. Yeah, maybe she'll... You haven't really tried, to be fair. I don't even know I what haven't. that is. A leaf. I'm a leaf on the wind. <laughs> I knew that would you hurt me. <laughs> you hurt me so much. So is, that, much. is that worse than Edward? Oh God! What is that? He's on the wind. What is that? That's from uh, Serenity. I don't know what that is. Firefly, the movie. I was. Um... It's okay. Yep. Is it? It's better you don't know. Hmm. They were at, I think it was Comic Con or whatever, where they were the creators of the show were talking about that movie. And they were like, Yeah, if we didn't have to make a movie, Wash probably would have lived. And Alan Tudor just stood up and he's like, What the fuck? <laughs> so, <clears throat> is there anything else you would like to ask Voltwood before he leaves? Uh, I got Lie. nothing. Lie safe. Thank you. I don't really have any thunder. Safe travels to you all. You are not like many mortals I've met. You must have really met some shit. There is mortals. only one Bobby. The last time I saw mortals was during the war. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's a long time. That's ago. a lot of people's impression is, you know, bloodthirsty, murdering, not giving a shit mortals. I mean, not all mortals are bad. Yeah. Not like, I may be bloodthirsty, but I'm not a murderer. <laughs> There's only one of him. Well, I appreciate so you, you saying that. I mean, I hope one day Harmony can come between us again. That would be nice. Yeah, I'll be around forever, probably. So, yeah. That is a champion's life. I forgot. Well, I died and then I came back and I You wear the mantle well. I appreciate that. Thank you. At least you won't be alone. You'll have Bobby and maybe uh, me. Fucking I'm only... Well, you can live a while. Yeah. You'll at least have the company of us dragons. You guys live, uh, what? <sighs> How long? Yes. I am currently 3,682 years old. I'm literally like 27. So I got a, <laughs> I got a while. You got a ways to go. I don't even know how old anymore. As what? long as your connection isn't severed, an eternity. Give or take a few millennia. Have fun. Everyone I love is going to die. Yep. You're 27? Oh. I think. I, I think I'm 125. Forgot. Oh, okay. No, you're, well, technically you're 600. Well, technically oh. not. Technically not. Her <laughs> aging stopped when she turned to stone. <laughs> yeah. So I would be like So, so, so Senku's still only like... 15. Okay, but we know that... How long was he in stone? Oh. How the days? 3 million seconds? 300 million seconds? I don't know. Which is how many He fucking years? counted. So is he an adult now? Technically? Yes. That means that everyone who got petrified is still conscious. Unless they got destroyed. I think he was only conscious because he had the... Like... He, the only reason why he's conscious is because he, that he forced himself to stay awake. He's a big brain. No sleep. God, Raven has a normal lifespan. Can warlocks get anything that makes them live forever? Uh, Their patrons yes, can grant yes. them longer life. Yes, if you're a patron of the Undying. Yeah. I don't know what I picked for him. Probably just the great old one. 
He could be a great old one too, though. I can pick a new patron. So, <sighs> Volt Ur gives you a small bow, and he <laughs> and transforms into his ancient blue dragon form and flies out of the castle. Oh, the, 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 the castle. castle? The palace. The palace. Castle. I, mixed, I mixed palace and castle. The castle. God damn it. Oh, no, we're not that down. <laughs> Yay. The castle. The castle. Give me that pass hole. I'll give you a pass hole. Right in the pass hole. Fucking throw the goddamn hot sauce. That's not what he. Not wears. the Valentinas. I have a sriracha packet. Oh, sorry. Oh, yeah. Is, is Marco a warlock? I have a sriracha packet. No. Or he's a wizard. Yeah. Uh, warlock. Warlock. They can forever, too, right? Yes, they can. It just takes one eighth level sriracha. spell and a Which cubic centim- a cubic inch of your flesh. <laughs> Which is what spell? Clone. Clone. Okay. But he's specialer than that. More special so, he flies out of the palace. Uh, and Ruzier looks around. So are we heading to his temple then? Well, I said we're guests, so I mean, if we want to get some food or something first, anyone's still hungry, we're good. Uh, I could eat. We should make sure we're prepared until before we go and have enough energy. Some blue kobolds are running around. Oh, but is he being? What is he holding? He's holding uh, a tray of uh, food. Is it a tray of charcuterie? Yes. Thank you. See How do you say? How do you say? Too late. Already gone. Damn. He's gone. Fuck. I ask. I'll ask my. Just you don't thank the slave. Hey, uh, just, just give it a song. Arnold, how do you? Fuck his understanding. <laughs> Heather, can you? Ask, how do you say thank you? I could just tell you. Yeah. So that, okay. says, uh, "Sobanibi." Sobanibi. <laughs> Quite interesting. What about the? Navy. How do you say like? Oh, cool. How do you say like? I don't think they've ever Actually, been not... in their lives. Probably not. This yeah, this kobold's got like a little pep in his step. <laughs> you think they've only been kicked and spat on, right? Yeah. I would assume so. It's pretty funny when it happens. Uh... God, you're terrible. Well, you're she is a royal. royal. You're used to that because you're royal. I don't so... treat them like that. I'm used to getting kicked and spit on, so. You were in prison. I that mean, into that? No! I mean, <laughs> I'm sure she I was a poor child! Well, maybe you should do that. You remember? I remember everything. Okay. You missed that conversation. Well, Bobby, you should totally, keep your totally just lying. Okay, because I don't want my po- your poverty rubbing off on me, okay? Fuck you, I have money now. <laughs> you do not. Actually, his poverty. He's the broke one. Yeah, you are the broke one. He has no home. Poor. He has no money and no home. I will burn your kingdom down. No, he has a he has a he has <laughs> a castle now. Stake. I guess I, I will I will finish what I started with your castle. I, I'll finish what my people started with you. <laughs> Dang! I'm just fucking with the red man. I wouldn't just you know completely annihilate your people. Planet. That's called genocide. So uh, not very too late. Much. Already happened. Oh, not very. Late. Not you very uh, your, harmonious you of you. Your, I'm just kidding. Your meats and cheeses. I gotta find something else around there's a kobold just like walking around you want to eat that one kobold that's fucked up I call you, no this is me part of your family no hey. <laughs> i mean their life expectancy is no, he doesn't even have a family his, his, their life yeah, expectancy is nine know. days yeah. right 11. Oh, 11. 11 days okay. hey. 11 days to two years i i i, I, I how many days he has he's gonna go here you're gonna no yeah, I, i'm gonna pick him up no he's gonna taste like i'm gonna see me i don't know here i give him to you don't can I go back there and have some fun? Davido, no. Some of it? I'm sure they're tasty. Um, go go away. Uh, Be this so. No. He's used to love. I have to go find it. He's probably never been touched with such care chicken before. Chicken or something. I don't know. I'll be back later. That is chicken. Nope. It's, it's the other other. It's meat. like it's like the exotic kind of chicken, like it's you know a special kobold. It's one. The endangered ch- kind of ch- free range. That's free range. Free range. <laughs> See, it, there ain't nothing them. free about it. It's pretty free. They, they're they're walking around. That's exactly. That's, that's what chickens are. They call them free range. It means they have a little bit more space to move. 
Yeah. But they don't because they're stored out and they can't even fucking walk. But they're free range. Just like those kobolds. Are you gonna go eat it? I'm not gonna eat a slave. Uh, maybe a homeless person, but not a slave. They're basically homeless. No, they, they have a home. Where do you think they sleep? They have a home. I don't know. Over there in the corner. You walk out of the past. Uh, almost did it again. <laughs> the palace. The palace. The palace. The palace. The palace. The pass hole. God damn it. Love it. You walk out of the palace and you see the base. Oh you can take that. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> but if I do that, then I'll wait, will I catch his crazy? No, he'll just kill the, the king of the bed. His bottle just tastes like brandy. <laughs> I feel bad. Yeah, but you don't have to kill him. You can just drink some. Evil. You can just drink some of it. <laughs> just drink some. The last time I tried to see drink some of it, they, they died. Well, then do the story and he just doesn't make his checks to push you off. And then you just get sucked dry. See what's over? Were there scrolls who were vivified in this game? That's I'll beat it, asshole. That's not a real thing. Uh, He's saying something to you. You don't know what it is. Shit. Don't know, eat him. Oh, look over there. Let's go down the alleyway. Is it just Bobby that went out? Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. So, but the people? He looks down the alleyway. And he. Eat better soul? Doba? I'm just like go, going that way and like, like look. Don't you see it? Go see Paul. He just you... he walks down the alleyway. Why don't you eat Crazy Joe? I, if like if crazy I eat Joe. Crazy Joe, I will definitely either explode or catch his crazy. <laughs> absolutely cap catch his crazy. His potions are, are pumping through his you, veins. You ever try to, yeah, if you try to bite Gale with a Starian, Gale's blood is like toxic. And a Starian <sighs> will get hurt. Yeah, that's why Gil said don't bite me because blood, blood is nitroglycerin. He's fucking... It's fucking like nitroglycerin. You can make your blood nitroglycerin later in the game. In Baldur's Gate, that, that drought girl has a potion that makes it so when you bleed, you it explodes around you. And glycerine! Oh shit. Glycerine! It doesn't hurt you. So, um, he walks down the alleyway. You gonna eat him? I will bite him, I guess. Roll stealth. He'll probably be happy about it. 19, oh no, it's 21, right? Fine. Both roll. Twenty-three. I'm sorry. <laughs> he did not notice you. <laughs> Give him the old one two. <laughs> That's four. That's a mandible. Huge pointy pointy teeth. Uh so you uh you go ahead and bite him. Eighteen. Oh, but see. He covers me. Big like seven damage. Oh. Oh, but see. I think he's dead. He's probably level one. He, he just passes out. Oh, okay. Maybe. Well, we can just, you know. Is he alive? He just passes out. You can keep checking his pulse and. Hey, I guess they're tougher than I thought. And it keeps sucking. No, I, I got what I needed. This blood. Tastes a little electrifying. Tastes like sand? No, electrifying. <laughs> Lightning energy. Sour? Yeah. <laughs> like, like you Lemony. Said, it's like, it's like you had, you're eating Pop Rocks. I'm just, just like, oh shit! <laughs> I'm okay, I'm okay. <laughs> uh, whoa! Just like, <laughs> your hair kind of stands up. That's wow. a zoid haircut. <laughs> Wowza. Okay. All right. <laughs> well, let me. He saw you. Sneak away. You know, so no, he didn't. He, he went down the other way and then he got bit and passed out. I had no idea what happened to him. <laughs> he can assume. Well, who's going to believe the crazy guy? Uh, right, yeah, you return, exactly. You return to everybody else and uh, what are you guys doing? <laughs> Eating a kobold. <laughs> <laughs> Are you kidding? No, 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 no. Just chewing Nobody would blink. <laughs> Nobody would blink. I'm, I'm, sure, they get I'm sure. I'm sure. What's his name would blink? Arnold. Yeah. He'd be like. 
<laughs> Open the depot! Open the depot! It's because it's not a crime. What it's the doing. meme where it's like... <laughs> it's like where it's like like close up on the guy's face and he's just like looking up like... Like that meme where... I always think of that anime girl and then it has a shadow of Zhongli's like... Oh yeah. The, and then she's like... Well, I guess I'm just eating. It's, I'm just not yeah. Eating. After you guys eat is getting a little later. Do you guys want to head to the Temple of Genesis? Yeah. Yeah. Do we want to do it now or do we want to rest wanna... before? Rest. Do we have time? I don't know. Or it's time for a short rest, maybe. Which spell did you pick first? Counter spell. Okay. We can do a short rest. <laughs> That's it's important. Which spell did you pick first? Yeah, we can do it. We can got six hours. Well, it's still she has three. It's three per spell. It's six hours total, right? Yeah, I thought it was two hours per level of spell. Yeah, it's six hours for just one. Oh, yeah, it's yeah. For one spell. Yeah, oh, you're right, you're right, you're the third we can level. just rest for us. Uh, we can just do a short rest, which is what? An hour. Yeah, it's an hour. And then, guys want to do a short rest spend any hit dice that you need to spend unless you I don't think anyone took any we, we haven't had combat yes, since we got yeah. here that we don't need to take a short rest <laughs> and the only thing i get back on a short rest is my detect magic then we can just go yeah that we can I, just go that i used in the all right so you don't have counter spell i mean she wouldn't even if we short rested yeah we'd have a yeah. long rest yeah which isn't happening so you guys head to the teleport gate and Razier looks around. Are we sure we want to do this? What do you mean, sure? Anything could be at that temple. Yeah. We're ready for this. Do you want me to go first? I can go first. Heather's just like, if you want my opinion. It's a terrible idea. Yeah, awful idea. I, I know. It is a terrible why, idea. Why are we going to this temple again? Because it's, uh, it was probably our... To see if the people we need to stop are there. Yeah, basically. Yeah. yeah I could go first. It doesn't matter. We we already. Decided. I won't get caught. I promise. I mean, you can go and come back. Come back. No, he has to right. say the words. Uh, well, wherever. Yeah, we're in a. Where, where are we? Umpes. Yeah. Unless Razir goes in with you. He can't. But... Sneak like I can. True. Well, we already decided what we're gonna do, right? <clears throat> I can go scout ahead. How are you gonna come back? Yeah, yeah. You can... Can, does it, anyone can open the gates, right? You just gotta say the magic words. Unless for some reason someone marked you as not able to use the teleport gates. Who would do that? Well, I mean, how how far does your telepathy go? Not that far. One mile. I think it's definitely more than yeah, a mile away. Yeah, absolutely more than a mile away. I think. Well, I mean, the, the king went to go talk to the other guy. The, the other king. The other king. Should we wait? That might take a while. Because. Yeah. What if he hasn't reached to him? One mile. If I don't come back, you just have to come get me. You will come get me, right? Yeah. Yeah, just like you almost saved me from the, at the library. Yeah. So you are going to go alone. Why is he going to go? Why well, do we should we should we make sure I can open the portals first? I guess say um say ka and touch the portal. Ka scud. Portal roars to life. It works. See, so I just got to say uh where are we again? Tumpes. Tumpes. Yeah, that. Are we sure we want him to go alone? Well, I mean, we, we can all go. Well, we just all Fuck go. you guys. If we all go, you're all going to get caught. Genesis Tumpel. <clears throat> Portal roars to life. All right, well. Drinks my potion of invisibility. <laughs> and then I'll go in. Okay, well, I guess. Oh, I think you'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, All right, Bobby, as you fun. enter. Just be ready to cast sending. Oh, I hear battle music. No, it's no. spooky music. 
as you enter, the formation of the rocks is crumbling. You see a derelict building ahead of you. And all around, roll me a perception check. 19. You hear. Oh. The same <laughs> creatures that you heard back in Althea. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There, it's too many, or too distant to tell how many there are. A lot, but you can assume a lot. Mm -hmm. And one walks by. <laughs> Looks it. <coughs> Sorry, that always makes me. Come. Um, looks in your general direction and continues walking. Two more levels, and I can do this whenever I want. Shambling mm -hmm. to be more precise. It shambles. Get close. I can go further and. Towards the temple. Potion of invisibility lasts like a minute, doesn't it? One hour. One hour. Oh, one hour. Literally just invisibility. Sweet. Okay, so you go close to the temple, and as you walk up the stone steps, the door is ajar. Not much of a door anymore, is it? Ah. Uh, um, and you peek inside. And you see what looks to be an amethyst dragonborn sitting in a kneeled position. Didn't uh, the book say that uh, Adelgrim was an amethyst dragonborn? <laughs> it did. Hmm. What else can I see? Um, you can see energy spewing out of something, and these creatures are <laughs> coming out of, coming out of uh, this energy. Let's see. Hmm. All right. Time to go back. All right. As you turn to go back, I want you to roll me stealth again. 23. <laughs> okay. This dice really is cursed. Mm -hmm. I told you I don't use it because it's a bad bitch. Does he get advantage for being invisible? Like he yeah. <laughs> 30! <laughs> <laughs> no, wait, that's more than that. Wait. No, yeah. Actually, I'm sorry. This is not a stealth based on sight. Oh, okay. 23, then. <laughs> I just thought about it for a second. I know you are there. <laughs> Start moving faster. <laughs> Don't say anything. <laughs> you cannot hide. Is that the Amethyst Dragon talking? It's the Dragon... It's Addy, yes. Addy, oh, Addy. That's a strong... That's a cute, too cute of a name for... Well, it's his nickname. It's just the shortened version Short. of the seven the seven <laughs> <over> name. <laughs> back to the portal, back to the portal. You're doing like the Asterian when he gets sent to the dinosaur place. 
Um, <clears throat> so as you get to the portal, you put your hand on the on the portal and you say, "Boss." Right? No. Something like that. Are you fucking kidding me, you asshat? <laughs> Are you doing this shit on portal. purpose? The <laughs> Hmm. You didn't write it down? Nope. Are you gonna do Nobody it? say anything. <laughs> I don't remember what it was, even though I didn't pay attention because this wasn't my problem. Are you gonna roll for it? It's funnier history? this way. It, it seems that that didn't work. Hmm. Do you try saying something else? Just, just, just think of, oh. Um, Shh. No, he's not. Shush. Shush. Just don't say you anything. You do not say anything. We're not here. I don't remember. <laughs> I will what? say you were close. Yeah, I know. It's like doing something. You fucking? <laughs> Why? Are you, Are you serious? Are you serious? Is that just Bobby? And as you turn That's around, Bobby. you turn around, and the the creatures are <laughs> they are started are starting to close in on you. How long has it been? Not that long. Not that long. Can I roll a history check then? Yes. Why didn't you write it down? Because it's funnier this way. It's not funny. <laughs> it's it's really funny. Funny. No, because yeah, if you funny. die, that like is uh, I don't care. Actually, well. you can't die. Oh, Tumpas wasn't it? Is it Tumpus? No. Tumpos? No. Uh, you can't Why think. not both? <laughs> Why did we let him? What did I try? Tumpas? Yeah. Tumpa. <laughs> Whatever, Fabi. <laughs> Give me die. Yes, I also my character would do. Be a fucking responsible player and write this shit down. <laughs> he knows what it is. He probably does. He does. He just being this character. And the these creatures are closing in on you. <laughs> No. And these other, and more of them start filing in. Got any other guesses? Can I make another history? Check? Yes. 13. <laughs> A little bit better. Okay. It's not Tumpa, Tumpas, Tumpos, Tumpus, Tum. Keys? <laughs> Right. I thought you said he. I knew that. I knew that. I thought about it. I was like, oh. Stupid. <laughs> Portal roars to life. Look at ass. <laughs> he knew it the whole time. I was like, oh, you knew it. I hate you. Just your character. Well, yep. Just Bobby being stupid. Just Bobby being Bobby. <laughs> Just Bobby being stupid. <laughs> That's all it is. Stupid. <laughs> So, hey. as the portal opens, nothing walks through. <clears throat> yeah, nothing walks through, and then... <laughs> oh, does the portal still open? Yes. <laughs> you should close the closet. Somebody close it. I don't know how to close it. There are two or three zombies that make it through. Uh, and the portal shuts. Damn it, Bobby. And... What the hell are you doing? Dragonborn, <laughs> Dragonborn begin looking over the... Who knows? Who knows? I stab it. Time to time to kill some zombies. Go ahead and roll to attack anybody who's attacking. <laughs> if I could fucking aim. Nineteen. Okay. So you got a 19? What did you get? I got a 15. Okay. What did you get? 17. 16. I got a 16. Okay. What do we add again? I got a Depends 17. on what you were attacking with. Are you attacking with like a melee attack or firebolt? I'm going to use, yeah. Wait. Firebolt. Well, it's a cantrip. Yeah. Yeah. Probably a good idea to use a cantrip. Yeah. I'm going to use firebolt. So you all hit these three zombies. Um, I don't need to know damage because all of you piling on them at once will... And they turn into goop. And they... They form together. And then... And they start sliding away. 
outside of town. Is, can I, is that a good thing that you did that? Can I hit the goop with a blade beam? Yeah, sure. <laughs> oh, that is radiant damage, huh? Yeah. So, go ahead and roll. That's a... Another 16. <laughs> it hits the goop. And it seems to have evaporated the goop. There's just a black stain on the ground. That, that, that'll buff out. That'll buff out. <laughs> so... Oh, Bonifis! Oh, Bonifis! So Bonibi! So Bonibi! Is that the that these, all these dragonborn begin to crowd you. What is happening? We... We killed him. It we... doesn't take much. It's just a little stab in action. I take it that something has happening over there. Uh, there's a lot of those things there, uh, and some other things. Do you see like what? Yeah. And uh, hey. and uh, uh, the uh, dragonborn doing it all, be being bad. Who? Which? The dragonborn kind of... we're looking for. Okay. So maybe we can't talk it out. He didn't seem very nice. Did he say anything to you? Did he see you? Did he see, yeah, did he see you? Or was I don't it just know if he saw like... me, but he knew I was there. He smelt you, maybe? But perhaps. Well, we've got a bit of a problem now. What's that? We can't really go through the teleporter again. Sure we could. Wait, why not? Because there's zombies on the other side of it now. Yeah, won't we just, op- just open the teleporter and then blast it through the teleporter? Yeah, it just, just, uh, you know what we need? We need a dragon. Oh, oh, oh. We just need a dragon friend to just blast a breath right through the portal. I do have a movable rod if I put it in front of it. I try to come through, they'll just be doing the limbo. <laughs> I don't yeah, think. Yeah, but he saw, <laughs> he saw the, that, that dragon there. Yeah. What if he's right, still we need, there we need, the whole time? We need time? to go over there, yeah. Well, well hey, I mean, I'm all for kicking his ass. <laughs> I'm totally fine with that. I, I can, can try talking first. I don't think he wanted to talk. He was seemed upset, or I mean, like, and by upset I mean evil. What's his full name again? Fucker. <laughs> Huddlegrim Gainsborough. Nope, you you skipped. Yeah, I skip. Skip. Oh, yeah no, you. I would just do the first that's and the last. That's just the last. Name. Yeah. Not the whole middle. It's like barnacle foot, you know, crotch how, stain. How fast does an ancient dragon fly? Dickweed. Pretty fast. Should we wait? What would the the blue dragon king have gotten be around the temple at this point? He was going to the temple. He was he going was to the, the red dragon palace. Yeah, but to the is, the is, it on, palace. is it on the way? No. <laughs> oh. It is actually separated from the continent. It's on an island. Did you say castle? Yeah. <laughs> The Red Dragon's Passel. Yeah, it's his Passel. <laughs> You've done it to yourself. Misspoke. <laughs> oh, it's fucking way out there. That's what that that's what that one is over there? Nope. Oh. Okay. Is the map pinned or no? Wait. It's pinned in the so. It's all the way on like a floating island on the right. Where is it pinned it's on? A yeah. different and then the, floating le- the Legends of Arcadia. It's, just, uh, it's this okay. one. In the channel for it. Yeah, that's where down. it is. Keep going down. Keep going down. Keep going down. This one? This. Nope. Oh. Oh, wait, maybe. Yeah. Yeah, it's that one. Hey. I don't think the map looks like more of So what are you guys doing? Should we really go through there right now? Do you see anything? What was going on? Just zombies? He was uh, creating a lot of zombies with some evil energy. How many were there? A bit. The longer we wait, the a more there are. between one and probably a million. We're gonna go fight him right now? I mean, we have a way to stop what he's doing. How? I hold out a grenade. Oh. <laughs> 
anti magic grenade. Future. <laughs> Future. Isn't that the thing you found? Do you want to just throw it through the portal? It's that will turn the portal off. That's yeah. true. Yeah. And my arm isn't that good. I can't exactly see where I'm throwing things from here. In the general vicinity. What if you like? It's not a big <laughs> radius. What, what, what if we like things? shoved it inside of him and then it blew up? The anti magic grenade. You think that would cut off his connection? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's. Fuck <laughs> rituals. We just. I don't think it's like, Force it. I don't think it's quite that. Um. Like that kind of magic. Reduce. Yeah. I don't... Oh no! It's the magical item, so we can't animate it. I can. You're trying to ant man this. You're trying to shove it up his butt. I still have the <laughs> enlarge reduce spell. It's just like the cow drop. <laughs> Make it small and this is... throw it in his mouth. We're the fucking we're the fucking boys now. Covering <laughs> <laughs> up bombs up people's buttholes. What did I use all my slots for? Yeah. I have Lots a way to take care of the zombies, but I don't really want to use it. Which is what? It's, it's kind of a, a bargaining chip. Well, maybe I can make some more more of that radiant oil. Johnny. Oh, ooh. Well, since we're here, let's grab a bottle of oil and I can enchant it for you. <laughs> Real quick. Can I try it? it I'm pretty sure it could just be any oil, but sure. Why don't we just convince the cactagons to come with us? Okay, what is a horde of zombies to? <laughs> it's a little horde of cactagons. That's true. Why don't we go find the cactagons real quick? Because we'd have to befriend these cactagons. Yeah, we'll say we know them. Um... I don't think they know them. Well, he has needles. And you can only get the needles if you survived a cactagon. They're gonna think we sure. killed a cactagon. Yeah. No, we'll say they're our friend. Let's talk to them. Can go home anyway. <laughs> Terribly. I mean, that, let's go try. I don't know if we have time for that. Are the deaths are just right outside? Can we just pull out? We gotta but find we cactagon. We gotta convince we just... them that we're friends, and then we gotta convince them to fight for us. It doesn't. Can we just seem... yell and say cactagon? I, mean, I don't think that's gonna work that way. Unless yeah. we started yelling in cactagonian. So we should just go through now. Chee chee. Chee chee. I can also polymorph Peter into something. You could polymorph him too. Cactagons are plants, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Damn. So you can't polymorph into a cactagon. <laughs> no. What do we polymorph into those zombie? To those creatures? No. No. Well, or a dragon. A fireball. Okay, let me enchant some of this magic oil. Just okay, uh, down. you. No, I'm pointing one of the random fireball. fireball. Yeah, you guys got fireball. But what is he? I have uh, level nine fireball. Tyler, can you tell him I need oil? That's. It doesn't oil. get any bigger. It just gets stronger. Guys. I know. So, but uh, Tiba, what do you do? Cool, but Tita. Biggest bottle you can find. But what is he? Iba Tobaza. He points at a at a stall. Okay, well, let me go look for him. Obasita, Uriru, Obasita. And it looks like a guy is peddling oil. Okay. And other uh and other like spices and herbs I'll and just stuff. Find the biggest bottle of oil. <laughs> it looks like a like a like a bottle of vegetable oil. Okay. How much? Obasita. Uh, so. What did he say, Heather? Uh, three gold. Is that a lot for vegetable oil? I don't really care oh. here. Oh, ah, soba nibi. <laughs> and he hands you the bottle of uh, okay. uh, vegetable oil. Now I'm going to go back and I'm going to enchant this oil with the power of my brooch. Peddling snake. <laughs> you, and tea, you want tea oil? <laughs> snake oil. <laughs> <laughs> See if I can... I think last time I had this with a beam counter brooch and I enchanted it. Okay, I'll try to get that mojo again and see if I can chant this oil. Roll religion. Religion. I get advantage, right? Yes, you are in Phoenixia's realm. Yeah, I'm also a champion, so we hope so. It just happens. I feel like it's... You just ask and it happens. <sighs> 13. I'm not good at religion. It's intelligence. I'll be with advantage. Do uh, it again. What do you... Uh... What do you say? Huh? She had a that was advantage. 
Uh, what do you say? I thought it was a three. Oh, what? Two. Bless. Uh, Sorry. Nixia, please bless this in order to slay the zombies we're about to fight and bring harmony to this realm. Slay the evildoers. Yeah. And get out of here, Satan. Your approach <laughs> begins to light up and. I just like to the fucking. And the oil. <laughs> It begins to emanate a radiating power. So now I have a radiant olive oil. oil. You have radiant vegetable how many, oil. How many uses does it look like this in this? It is a big bottle. Probably could coat at least like five weapons. If we coat our weapons, Bobby, you should coat your weapons too. Bobby's weapons are. Well, mine are mine are magical already, but I coating with holy might give it. Let's see. I mean, I do have my crossbow and whip. Um... Mine's poison already, so it's fine. I, c I could coat my scimitar so that it does radiant. The visible blade of death is invisible, so coating it would make it visible. So I'm not gonna yeah, do that. Yeah, it would make it uh, yeah. slightly corporeal. Yeah, I, I'll make my. I'll just do it to my scimitar. Slightly corporeal looking. Is yeah, right. yeah. So they'd be able to see it. I think that would get advantage. Okay. Well. I don't think half the damage is gonna be worth it anyway. I don't think poison really would affect a zombie. It's just the extra dice damage on it. It's 2d4 poison, 1d6 poison. It's fine. I don't, I don't know if So if you coat your, your weapons in this uh, oil, it'll give you an extra 1d6 radiant damage. Okay. I mean, I'll take it. Yeah. Yeah. So how many weapons are you coating, Bobby? I only got one weapon that can be coated. I got two. And I got my whip. You're not gonna use it. No, I know, I know. I'm just saying, like, I have a whip, the quarter staff, and a crossbow. You're not. Did you want to attempt to try to find the cactagons? If just, I'll only spend a short amount of time, and if I can't find them. Although we shouldn't coat our weapons yet. Yeah, I'm, well, no, I'm not going to. We will coat them before the battle. So, you have multiple directions you can go. Um, from Tumpes, you see that there is um, a large structure to uh, the southwest of you. Southwest, yeah. Should be. Sure, we'll go that way, I guess. Yes, southwest. Yeah, there's a large, large structure to the southwest. Um... Why does our camera, our camera like moved, I think. It did. It's a, it felt like, it's a, it looked like somebody was hitting the table like from underneath or something. Oh, it might have, I might have touched the cable on accident or something. Um, and there is uh, what seem to be ruined structures to the southeast of you. <laughs> Maybe they'd be ruined structures. Oh, well, there is, I think it's tiny. So it's all dependent on where you want to go. There is a there is a few yeah. structures far to the west, and there seems to be another village, um, to the northwest. How long would it take to get there? How long would it take to get to the ruins? The ruins, it would take you half a day, maybe more, oh. depending on how fast you went. We don't have that kind of time, right, Peter? How long would it take me with Peter? If you want to fly up with Peter, you could scout the area and see if you see any cactagons. Yeah, okay, let me do that. Alright, so you fly up, 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 up with Peter, and uh, go ahead and roll me perception with advantage, please. Because you have a quite a bird's eye view. I'm counting up. Three and four. <laughs> Seven. All my dice are not treating me nice today. <laughs> There's a lot of sandstorms. Uh, if you fly to a different position, I'll let you try one more time. Okay. Want to try me, one of these move. dice? No, no, no. Nothing you can do. Nothing that you have, no. <laughs> we know your rolls are shit. Yeah, because I'm older. rolling them. You're older. Okay, my, I have my dice over here if you want. Okay, but you want I, mean, I have, have the green ones. I have these ones here, too. <laughs> you can't read that shit. Right, I mean, I have these ones sitting right here in this stupid hair tie. 
some reason you decide to use those atrocities. Well. Just... I can't read that shit either. Okay. Well. I can't read that. 15, that's 11? Is that an 11? Yeah. Bruh. There is a sandstorm that seems to be moving fairly quickly uh, to the uh, to the southeast. It is heading from the ruins towards Tumpes. Ruins? A sandstorm from the ruins? Yes. Oh, it, is a, it is a smaller, more concentrated sandstorm, and it seems to be moving. Uh, How long would it take me to get to that sandstorm? Uh, on Peter, not very long. Okay, guys, I'll be right back. Sandstorm's coming to you, too. I'll be right back. I'll just make sure I don't go close enough to get caught in it, but... Um... So as you fly down with Peter and you get closer, it is a herd of Cactagon that are running that fast. Um, excuse me, uh, uh, and, and I'll comprehend language. I haven't used it to me. Okay. That's... Isn't comprehend that's language one. just for reading? You want, you no, want... no, it's for understanding. It's it's for understanding and reading. So, but they, so, they, 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 they understand common. common. Yeah. Well. Well, the ones that... The ones are, that we live with, too. So you say, excuse me, they cheat, cheat. What was that one's name? What? Why do I keep Edward? Forgetting? Edward? There's what if no they know Edward? They would know. No, maybe. Who knows? Hello. Cheat, 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 cheat. I can understand them. That's right. What are you doing here? Um, I came to... You are not scaled like the others. No, I'm from down below in Terra. There are more of your kind down there. I met a guy named Ah, Edward. from the before times. Yeah, there's a guy I met named Edward down there. And he's uh, with the other herds. Tactagon exists down there. Uh-huh. We helped them, actually. They... Roll persuasion. <laughs> <laughs> right. I do that. <laughs> Nice. 29. Is it toasty? Yeah, toasty. Hmm. So you are friend to Cactagon? Yeah. We actually came to ask you for help. You see, this continent that you're on is in danger of falling. We found the one that's responsible and we need help taking them down. Falling? You mean to the surface? That and being destroyed, as in uh, the amethyst dragons have already fallen. They're being attacked, and it would disrupt your harmony here too. And we would was wondering if you would help us keep the peace here and save your land. I know it's a lot to take in, but it's happening right now. We hold no love for the scaled ones. They have hunted us for years. Well, generations even not for them more for yourself because if they get wiped out so will you but if things go well and you are saved you might be able to assimilate with the land below and be with your fellow cactagon who are actually down there treated pretty well now they don't get messed with and uh we created kind of a place for them hmm. roll another persuasion 30. It's the, the, one of the few things that they're good at. I am good at this. This seem agreeable to Cactagon. I am Chiakto. I am Oscar. Pleased to meet you, Oscar. Um... If you want to follow me back, I can show you. You guys run pretty fast, yeah? We can traverse the desert quite fast. So basically, I would have you guys... How many do they look are there? At least 30. Okay, you guys can come with us, and I'll lead you through a portal to go uh, fight against them. You guys are very, you know, powerful, so I feel like you'd be great allies. I appreciate it. Lead way. Okay, so I'll bring them back. Guys, I found them! Did you see the sandstorm coming? And all the dragonborn are like, Oh, my Zeba! Oh, my Zeba! 
We keep I feel like we do not panic. I feel like we've made an uh, an error of judgment. They only can move in sand. That's not necessarily no, true. No, that's not true. They just move well in sand. Oh, yeah. Edward never wanted to leave the sand. Well, he likes. <laughs> yeah, why would he <laughs> want to leave the sand? It was nice there. Yeah. He wasn't gonna. He wasn't gonna travel with you all around the oh, world. No, of course not. Going through the portal in thousand needles. Did you think if you put that um, thousand needles, third, what, third bar, right? right? Did, you, did you think if you put your thing in the anti magic field, we wouldn't be able to go back <clears throat> through the portal? What? Because the portal's magic. What are you talking it about? feels great, Quish. It feels if you great. Put the, if you put the magic device you want to use, the anti magic. Yes, I just said that. If I put them through the portal, what would happen? Then we wouldn't be able to go back. Through no, the portal. you have to activate it and then use it. Yeah, I know, but there's a big radius for that. Mm, not that big. Yes, it is. I don't recall it being that big. Do you, how big is the radius of that anti magic thing? It's not that large. No, because remember they had. I'm pretty sure it was just like. It's like 30 feet. The spell magic range. Yeah. Having diplomacy stop. Fa- what, what is talking about? Because I, I stopped. Uh, when he ran the Dragon War one shot, I stopped an encounter with Cactagons. Oh, I because see. I telepathically communicated with them, oh, which yeah. I could also do. Yeah, he could also do that. And so he's just like, "How does it fucking feel?" I was like, "Feels great." He's thing. like, "Unlike you, I enjoy Cactagon." <laughs> he's like, "He's like liar." No, he enjoys Cactagon too. He made the stat block, and he wanted to use it. And I was like, "Nah, I want to be the first one to use it." So, anyway. So I came back with the cactagon. Are they full grown? They are pretty big. Well, bigger than. Fuck me sideways. And... I let them know their land was being threatened, so they decided to help. Okay. Cheat, cheat. Oh, 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 oh crap. <laughs> <laughs> that one had to be cheat, cheat. <laughs> cheat, cheat, motherfucker. <laughs> Poot a little. On that one. <laughs> oh, no. You like them? <laughs> well, I guess we're ready. Oh, that's that, that. Those are big. There's like 30 of them. <sighs> a lot. Are they taller than the ones at home? Are they These are big. Red, they're taller than Redmane. Well, the ones at home are taller than Redmane. These are big motherfuckers. What did he say his name was again? Chiocto. Chiocto. That's like a sounds like a Native American name, kind of. <laughs> kind of where the inspiration came from. Yeah. Sounds like they're native to the land. They're also Native getting... American cross with like a cactuar. Yeah, you also you also repeated their history a bit too. Ooh, <sighs> <sighs> All right, well, water. what are they called? Cacti. Cactagon. Cactagon. Okay. Mm-hmm. Got it right then. Just want to double check. They're cactuses and octagons. <laughs> they have eight sides and eight legs and 10,000 needles. Oh no, they're spiders. Look out, imagine. No, they're not spiders. <laughs> they're not spooters. They're spooters. Not spooters. don't really fuck with the cactagon anymore because they'll absolutely murder you. Yeah, because they. <laughs> Over the They've tried before and they just. They just... Those they bandits? just come back as a pile of needles. A lot of a lot of the army seen army was fucked up by the gun. Yeah, well, because the 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 time that we they keep sending them out, and all we keep getting back is needles. Acupuncture. There's nothing left. Well, the only reason I think that they another got, one even full grown cactus. Well, they no. got wiped out before I think because of the um the war the um, fire. I bet. <laughs> oh, probably. <laughs> it's probably during the war. So I'm almost like, what the fuck are we fighting plants for? Just burn them. And Edward couldn't find his friends to help them repopulate. Well, if everything and then, he did. and then and then someone someone found the someone found them and told Edward. Yeah, and made it rain. Yeah. <laughs> and now we have giant cactus on. <laughs> for the good of the land. All right. You guys have your Cactagon army. Well, it's more of a battalion, but yeah. 30? It's practically an army. <laughs> so we're going to, you know. <laughs> I'm here, fucker. Oh, yeah. You 
mortals are truly fascinating that you can befriend such devastating creatures as Cactagon. We live fast and die hard. <laughs> I would rather we didn't die. We're gonna all. go. We're gonna fuck this dragonborn up. We're gonna teach him a goddamn lesson. Okay, make sure we cut our weapons before we go in. Mm-hmm. We're ready to, like, you know. Be ready. Mmm. Holy. It burns. <laughs> As you look at Holy. <laughs> oh. Mistakes were made. Mistake for made. So, Ruzier just looks a little worried. <laughs> We're like getting up for the apocalypse over here, like. <laughs> gotta pull the grenades out. Fucking. Well, I mean, it basically is, right? Zombies? Buckle, <laughs> buckle your utility belt, your, your bat suit with your bat nipples. <laughs> yep. The whole. The just bat butt. Put the bat suit on, stick on the bat nipple stickers. <laughs> They're just stickers? Well, yeah. You guys really designed nipples on this suit? <laughs> so, <coughs> Ruzier's just like, all right, if we're sure about this. Yeah. I've never been more sure about something in my entire life. Just kidding, that's confidence. Genisi Stumpel. Portal roars to life. And as you bust on through the portal, Buster. immediately the Catagon <laughs> go first and then the zombie. <laughs> <laughs> and these zombies are just going down as the Captagon just spread out and uh, and gather like all their aggro. Cheat, cheat, motherfucker. <laughs> cheat, cheat, motherfucker. <laughs> this was an option. We did. So who mentioned the Captagon? Because I didn't even Me. think of that. And as you go through, you have a cleared path. To the temple. And the guy, the person's, we don't Let's know who's going yet. He's in He's, the temple. Yeah. Okay. So Shoot. as you run forward and these, um. Here, take one of these. How many do you have? Three. <laughs> Please don't. I already like it. Why are you telling me to take it? Because he has, he's the throwing expert. But the person that doesn't actually know how to use this thing? He knows how to use it. Just throw. Hit button throw. Yeah. <laughs> Grenade. You, you actually use it. You see, I know how to use it. Yeah, it's like this. <laughs> Wait, not now, buddy. No, no, buddy, buddy. Oh, no, buddy, buddy. Moiraine just cannot cast magic anymore. Well, not a No, no. What is All that right. from? Put my hood up. Is that a sponge? No, it's hmm. a sponge ball. It might be sponge ball. So you run towards the temple. You uh, do you just bust through the doors, not even giving a shit? Yeah, we, we knocked, right? We we did the whole knock. That was on the that was on the portal. Oh, that was the portal. Oh, okay. The cactagons knocked for us. Yeah, the cactagons. Fuck, <laughs> we're just like. FBI, open up! <laughs> Send in the fucking SWAT team. Yep. <laughs> Cactus Team 6. Uh, so, uh, as you get into the uh, main temple room... Temple room? You see the Amethyst Dragonborn sitting there kneeled. And this dark energy... Pumping more zombies out. Um, there's just like just <laughs> shooting arrows at the ones that keeps coming out. I'm back, bitch! <laughs> you see me now, bitch. <laughs> you have tried to stop me before. No. Now, no. Oscar, you remember this voice. This is the voice of Genesis. Oh, Genesis. Oh, you're not Adelgrim. Of course not. He is only a tool. I guess the talking it out isn't going to happen. Are we sure he's the tool? You can try <laughs> speaking to him. No, I'm sure he's not receptive. Hey, Adelgrim. 
Gainsborough. I only know the first and last, but like, don't let this asshole take yeah, up your body. I don't remember even the first name. It's, what, it, it is the first name. Is it? it is Adam. Um, yeah. I know they call you Addy, so like, if you want to let this asshole take over you. I think he's perfectly yeah. content with letting this asshole take no, over. No, fuck him. This is bad. As soon as you address Adelgrim, you see him stand up and turn around. Symbol of the flaming eye is in his eye. I think we gotta fuck this guy up. Come on, Addy. Let's uh, let's not. I think you have friends. Sounds like they nicknamed you. Everyone I've ever known and loved is dead. Which is what you are about to be. Well, you I'll send you to the Almighty myself. What happened to all your friends? It's been 2,000 years. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, that's gonna happen to me too. The friends are dead. You can make new friends. You just have to make friends with somebody who's immortal. Yeah, Addy, I can be your friend forever. I don't die. Like, from old age. Thanks, but I don't associate with mortals. But I'm not immortal. Anymore, now I'm immortal. <laughs> Technically. I'm not immortal, I'm immortal. You were descendant of the ones that slew my kind. Yes. Therefore, I don't like you. Yeah, but you're killing everybody. You're killing your own kind, too. You're destroying this realm. Everybody dying. They're weak. They don't deserve to live. Who deserves to live, according to your standards? Only oh, you asked. destruction, hatred, and betrayal deserve to continue on. What about punishment? Asking for a friend. <laughs> I don't think this is working. I really am sorry, y'all. Unfortunately, you're on the chopping block. Addy, I want to try to talk you out of this because we're going to take care of you right now. <laughs> and we can either take care of you in a nice way and we can be friends and just talk this over. Or we're going to kill you. But like, I don't want to have to do that if we can just be friends here. I'm Let's sorry. I'm, I'm sorry that my kind Let's slew be you friends. before. We have made many mistakes, and we're trying to <laughs> mend it. Bring you in warm. I've you talked in to cold. the other dragons. <laughs> you choose. You hear uh, the voice uh, behind Addy. It is quite amusing that you keep trying. Keep on trying. Maybe one time he'll listen. Um, uh, yeah, why not? If it I didn't mean, work for Xanax, when yeah, even this is I different. tried. By that time, he killed you all. Oh, I mean, if he starts attacking, then I start attacking and stop talking. But, like, we're still talking. We're still having a conversation. No one asked you. Should we tell the friend? Oh, uh, yeah. I'm you freedom. guys can do it while I'm talking and distracting that's him. What that's what I'm saying. Like, What's that going to do? That's not going to do anything. It's going to turn off the magic. <laughs> what magic? Uh, the, his magic, the portal, the, portal, the, the, the evil <laughs> summoning zombie portal. Well, you can do that well because he's and distracted. And then I can stab the absolute shit out of him. I, I'm, I'm, you guys should take this opportunity because I'm still talking to this, to Addy. But then you're just reinforcing the belief <laughs> that we're not to <laughs> be trusted. Well, it doesn't matter. It doesn't seem like they're going to. So at this point, I'm just, I mean, unless they want to listen to me, but it doesn't sound like they want to. I'm but, just letting you exhaust your talking option. Yes. I just, I want there to be harmony between all races. That's what I'm trying to do. There, there were bad humans. There were bad dragons. There were bad everybody. But the mistakes of your ancestors don't define who we want to be and who we are going to be today. Harmony cannot exist in its current state. All we need to do is just allow the Almighty to continue his crusade and let him win. Why? That's not Because harmony. then true harmony can be brought to all. <clears throat> that is not true harmony. That is just death and destruction. That doesn't make anyone happy. There'll be nothing left. Is that truly what you want? Is it you so bitter from the from before and from all your friends dying from being alive for so long that you just surrendered yourself to this destruction? I have lost more than you could ever know. I, don't I want you to roll me perception real quick. Okay. Nine. I'll give you advantage because you're closer to him. You're actually like, you know, <clears throat> focused on 14. Him. Wait. 16. <laughs> you see a tear stream down his face. 
Addy, I still see see humanity in you. Is that a tear? You've lost a lot. Is that a tear? I may Get not understand your pain completely, but <laughs> I've lost many of that I have cared about. I've lost many innocent people because of Sanax's destruction. He's killed many innocent children, women that I had a duty to protect and I failed them. I know loss. Me too. And I understand your pain and I don't want you to go through this. You don't have to do this. You could still turn back. Sanix is nothing but a weak piss ant. I mean, yeah, but hey. you're not. Are you so weak that you're going to be controlled by, by Genesis? All you are is a pawn to him. You're stronger than that. You believe I'm under control. I've never been more free in my entire life. That's how he makes you feel. Yeah, That's how it was with you and... Sanex was her friend, too. He let it consume him, thought he was free and controlled, but really, he was just another pawn. You're gonna be nothing once he's done with you, but we can make you something if you stay with us. You can do better. Oh, I am something. I am something to be feared. Something that is worse than any nightmare that you have ever experienced. And why do you want to be that? Does it bring you some fulfillment? It brings me peace. There's other kinds of peace. It doesn't have to be like this. There's other people out there, other relationships you can form, other bonds, other people. The only peace worth fighting for is through destruction, and it shall be so. Okay, well... Who are you to choose that for everyone? I mean, we're not going to let that happen. We've already dealt with Sanix before. Then, unfortunately, you will have to die. We gave you a choice, Addy. I'm already dead. Wait, that didn't sound as tough as I thought it was. <laughs> so is the talking over? I tried. All right. Your god failed. Time for my god. Considering I didn't roll any persuasion checks, it made me think that it was just not going to work. Fireball. Harmony fails. Punishment begins. He's been a bad boy. Now he's going to die. Negotiations always have broken down. I'll throw a grenade. All right. So you throw an anti-magic grenade? Yeah. Click. Just a little toss. No, I'm closer to you. I just didn't want to have to fight him, really. Just too much work. Not too much work? Mm -hmm. Too much work to fight the two millennia warlock? Yeah. He's about to be a zero millennia warlock. <laughs> Stay up. All right. Dave's I wonder how many millennia mine up he has. He's Probably got the millennium <laughs> eye, at least. As long as he doesn't have the puzzle. The puzzle's the worst. <laughs> I would hate to fight the puzzle. <laughs> so, you throw the anti-magic grenade, and it hits the ground. What's that gonna... <laughs> Future, and bitch! You see, the, you see um, the portal that was uh, that was spewing out energy, and you see Genesis go... <laughs> And it forms back in, and you see the at the you see the amulet. It is the medallion. You grab it. Oh, oh. fuck! I'm, I have Peter still. I'm gonna fly over. I can get it. I can get it. We're in a temple. You have Peter. You're flying on Peter in a temple. It's not. How big is it? I don't know. I don't know. I can get it faster than anyone here. And go you see, as yeah, he yeah, had his spear fine. outstretched, as you hit him with the with the anti magic grenade, the spear fades. And oh, uh, he was. He's a fucking. Oh, he's that kind of warlock. Okay. Yeah. And he... Oh, and he hits the ground. And I will... Bobby, now, get, the, get the amulet. I, yeah, let me dagger over to the amulet. Well, don't... Hey, did, you know you, did you throw it on the outside from our portal we can escape to? My, so as you, the as you, as you the throw outside. your dagger and you throw it through the anti-magic thing, the dagger... It's not magic. It's not magic? No. That's my class features. It's just, it's psychic energy. It's not technically magic. <laughs> Here, I, I will, I, let, me, like... let me, let me read it to you. Where's the... 
It's Con Shonery. That's who you want to shout out. Con Shonery. Yes, Con Shonery. Con Shonery. But also Rip Sean Connery. Because it's called Soul Knife. Let's see. <laughs> you harbor a wellspring of psionic energy within yourself. Energy is represented by your psionic energy dice. Yeah. How would you, it's psychic energy? So however you want to rule that. I'll allow that it's not magical. But I said I can never be disarmed because I. I mean, unless they just cut off your arm a bit. No, because then he can just be Zoro and put one in his mouth. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> All right, so you, you <laughs> teleport over to the amulet and you pick it up. Yeah, we, we get enough distance. Well, how far is it? Uh, it is about uh, 40 feet away. Oh, yeah, cool. I, I got so plenty of plenty of movement. Well, I have to roll. It's a, it's a, I have to roll one of my deep, one of my psychic dice and it's that's how far I can go. So, that's so right. I rolled a six, so it was 60 feet. Um, All right, so you get there and you pick it up. I want you to make me a wisdom save, please. Um, oh, yes, hold on. Right. To subtract a psychic energy dice. Here we go. Actually, wait. Scratch that. You're in an anti magic field. You don't have to make a wisdom save. Sick. <laughs> mm. Oh, right, because it's magical. Yeah. Oh, does that mean Peter D summons? Only if he walked into it. Oh, it. Over there. Yeah, I have what, if, what happens if a bag of holding goes into an anti magic circle? Everything comes out. Do you out have now. the bag of holding on you? No, no. no. She no, does. She... Oh. Probably I... don't want to know. If I toss you this magic amulet, can you catch it in the bag of holding? Yeah, I can put it in there. I just mean with like literally catch it with the open bag because I don't want you I don't want anyone touching it. I can try. Okay. It's good enough for me. Yeet. So slide of hand <laughs> for that throw. Or actually I'll let you make an attack roll, whatever's higher. Sleight of hand. Okay. By a lot. By, well, I mean, not like a lot, a lot, but by, by a four. Lot. By, by more than four. Uh, really 26. Damn. My sleight of hands plus 13. Oh, okay. You, you swing the chain that it's on and. Expertise, bitch. Right. Yeah, um, I like figured your attack to hit. Oscar, plus nine. you need to roll. It's plus um, five unless I have proficiency. You need to roll a dexterity save in order to catch it <laughs> in the bag of holding. Can I use Bigby's Can hand I? to grab it? I mean, you have mage hand. You can just mage hand it if you fail. That's why I didn't really I care that much. Mage. Oh, she has mage hand. I I'll, have big B's hand. I'll, I'm trying to catch it in the bag. I'll just assist. Okay, so you'll pick up Oscar. <laughs> Try to Careful, SpongeBob. <laughs> Careful, SpongeBob. So, uh, with advantage. 19. <laughs> That's good enough for me. I have really it, good is, it is in the bag, and you close it. Run. Are we leaving now? Yep. Okay, let's wait, go. Wait, we're not going to... No. Wait, we could kill him. No. We could kill him forever. Probably not easy. Probably. We know we have the uh, knowledge to do that. That's true. Let's he wants it. peace. Let's give him peace. Yeah, yeah. Actually, he sure. looks up. Run. Now, oh, fuck you. <laughs> yeah, but, I, I we, follow what yeah, you said. We, we can sever their connection without killing them. The severing the connection will kill him. Absolutely. He's been alive for 2,000 years. And that's years. fine. Let's sever the connection. We can do it. I can draw the circle real quick. Addy says run. Addy says yeah, run. Yeah, he does. In, Addy in, says run. In a caring manner. Or... <laughs> we should we should sever his connection. He might be a problem. Because I can. We need his blood, right? I got a dagger that literally sucks people's blood out. Twenty-five <clears throat> is definitely different than the than the manner that he was speaking to you. Does he have something on him that looks like um, it would be an amulet or something for his patron? Um, perception. We'd have to beat him into submission first. Fifteen. Um. He does, but it looks tarnished. No, he's weakened because he can't use his magic because he's a warlock, so we can just take advantage of this. But how long do these last? How many we got? They what if stay. we just use them all? They stay. If we need to, we have another one. We have like three. But I yeah, think Addy, only... Addy's... He's... Uh, I'm literally standing Addy, right next to him, Addy's by the way. Addy's form to speak to you was a little bit more... It wasn't like the... It was not a... It was not like, was, run, it was, bitch. It was, it was like, it was, run. Yeah, it was different than the previous one. Yeah, it was we, different we than having... We should tie him up. We should sever his connection now. I'm going to stab him anyway so that I have his blood... Just in, you know, just in case. Just to have it as a backup. Because, because you gave me this new dagger that that takes people's blood. Yeah. <laughs> Do we want to sever his connection? 
He needs to go. You need you need hours of prep time. Yeah, we don't in order to do it. Do, yeah, I, do I have advantage? We have He's to prone, yeah. right? Can I can I, can, okay. I can I grab his um tarnished brooch? I wouldn't sure. touch that. I don't, well, I mean, I guess twenty eight. I can. I'll, yeah, I, you hit I, him. Can I? I, I can mage hand it. And then put it in my bag of holding. So you, you um, can you use it because you'll be close to the. I'm not gonna use magic. it right now. I'm taking it for later in case we need to sever his connection. I know, but okay. also, can I look around to see like if there's? But he's in the magic. If there's anything magic, like. Um, oh right, with the magic, I have to grab hand? it. I have yeah, to I don't feel like that. I need to be not walking out for like. Why would he just? Why would he be? Why would he say run? In the manner he did. Don't let me think about it too hard. We're going to leave. He takes 35 damage. Okay. Okay. <laughs> and then I just want to grab that brooch. <coughs> oh, you rolled sneak attack on him? I have advantage. Yeah. Why would I not roll sneak attack? That's fair. Are you close to him? I teleported right next to him because the for the amulet. Bobby, grab that amulet. He already threw it to you. Oh, you mean, you mean oh, his, oh, his brooch. brooch. Bobby, grab that brooch. Since you're right there. Can Is he gonna let me? He's like... He's not doing anything. As you stab him, he... <clears throat> I understand. Just grab it. Yeah, he'll, he's, he doesn't seem like he's... Oh. He's like a little country boy. I understand. He, it's okay. <laughs> he takes the brooch off and he grabs your hand, puts the brooch in. Oh, go. All right, bye bye. Uh, it seems like he is being controlled. Everyone's being controlled. Uh, of course, you're being controlled. Yeah. Genesis controls all of his champions. Why would it, Why would the, uh, someone who was a hero fall so so fast so quickly? So we can prepare, prep everything for later. If we want to come back and deal with them. How long? So the we, magic works. It doesn't matter. I don't know. I'm not about one. to find out. We have another. I'm one. running we'll, away we'll, again. We'll use it again next time. <laughs> Okay, let's go. <laughs> you do it like that. But you see, you, you, you want to pick up the grenade? <laughs> what? Are we taking it with us? It doesn't get reused. Oh, no, they don't. No. It's a grenade. It's, uh, it's used. It's a one-time use. Oh, I thought you, you ever seen a them. reusable grenade before? It's, it's a futuristic magic. That's fair. It's a fair point. He has a fair point. And most, still. most magic items that work like this tend to be like... When it was used last time, it was a one-time use. So okay. it's still uh, a one-time use. The fact use. that we have this made, uh, made this way easier. Kung Fu Hustle. Have you ever seen Kung Fu Hustle? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's right. I fucking love that movie. Okay, well. So, tell the Cactagon to retreat. Yeah, I'll say that too. Retreat. Cactagon, retreat. Retreat. Uh, Ruzier is just like, that was insane. Oh, we can't let us like in the was portal. What do you mean? It's just Wednesday. <laughs> Don't pass. Where's Where's Arnold? Oh, he didn't come. He didn't come. Oh, of course not. Okay, good. No, we don't need him coming. He's just a detriment. Yeah, he would and die. We all head through the portal back to Tumpes, and all the Cactagon go through, and you are all relatively safe. That doesn't sound. This doesn't go. feel right. We actually For did your, something uh, right. God cutting off needs his thingy bop. I'll take and put it in the bag of holding. I feel like this was too easy. Everything's easy when you have an army of Cactagon. Mm -hmm. I mean, yeah, that and helped. Miss Ozzy and technology. Yeah. I hope too. <laughs> yeah. I'm just the Cactagon help. look over at Oscar. Glad we could help. You got to Aragorn them. Consider your oath repaid. <laughs> I hereby... Proclaim your oaths fulfilled. Yes. Thank you for helping. We're safe for now, but there's still much to do. If you need us, simply call. Cheat cheat. <laughs> That's all you guys are hearing. No. Cheat cheat. Yeah. Cheat 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 cheat. I'm used to not understanding the conversations. Especially here. I just go by context. You're hearing them say Chi Chi and Oscar respond in common. I mean, that's normal. Yeah. That's kind of how my my dad com com communicated when he was in Germany. 
Just who would speak English and they would speak German. So, now you wait for the return of King Voltur and whether you will be let into the sacred city of Ha'amun. Boy, I sure hope so. We should probably not take the necklace with us. Well, it's in the bag of holding. The bag of holding is fine. Better to keep it with us is safer because this place is coming down. Uh, yeah, but agreed. It's you have gained a piece of Genesis. I had another piece before. And I gave it back. And if you ever find Onam, perhaps you could restore his power. Yeah, maybe I can give it back. Restore to him. his confidence. So if he has a piece of Genesis, then I can. How did he? Yeah, how did he hold that part... and not fuck him up? Yeah, was it was it part of the contract with the broker to get him all the pieces of Genesis or no? No, we were mm. the nine pieces of eight. We we're no, the, it, it the, was con- just to... the contract was just to give him that piece and then also just to give him the ring back. No, they're, actually, that wasn't part of the contract at all. The ring back. <laughs> Okay, that's fine. That was, and that was just me being a nice person. By uh, luck, technology, and Catagons on your side, you were able to evade the full force of Adelgrim Brokart, Vladimir fucking... Dufoot, Everard Ferdugas, okay, Gainsborough. I'm never going to remember that. But, that guy. So we went back Maybe to the Magic for name, which made this probably significantly <laughs> easier for us than it would have been. You're welcome. I didn't think it was going to completely cripple him. It completely cripples you if you're a fucking spellcaster. That sucks. Well, he couldn't. He couldn't summon his weapon because he's a hexblade. He's a hexblade. Yeah. yeah. I was just like raving. He couldn't yeah, summon dude. his pack weapon. Then he can't do anything. That sucks ass. Yeah. Too bad we didn't use our <clears throat> my pack weapons are magic, bitch. Huh? We didn't use our blades at all. We didn't even fight. No. It's fine. It's I was fine better. with it. Yeah, it worked out better that way. I can just make more, <laughs> make more holy olive oil juice. <laughs> And so you head back into Umpes Palace. Better to be prepared than... Um, The servants there show you to uh, your rooms. And you are able to sleep and rest easy for the night, knowing that you did a good job. And that is where we'll end tonight's session. They were saying they wanted to see it. You know, uh, Adam yeah, Quiff wanted to see Addy's full power. We didn't want mm-hmm. to see it. <laughs> no, we didn't want to see it. Because, because, because when Addy was that. in the one shot, he was like, what? Like level eight, level 10? So, so like 2,000 years from that, he's definitely level 20. Yeah. It sounds like he's kind of a, he used to be a good guy. I played as Addy. That was my character <laughs> in the one shot. Yeah. I guess he got corrupted somehow. I mean, 2,000 years. Uh, well, he served Genesis worried. from the beginning. So in that one shot, he was serving Genesis. Is Genesis the god of destruction? Yeah. Yeah. He was serving Genesis, but he's still, he's a, at least in the one shot, he's a good guy, but he does evil things. But he's a good guy. So lawful evil? Kind of. Mm-hmm. More like chaotic neutral. Now he is. Yeah, he used, to, he used to be like lawful evil or lawful neutral. That would feel like the worst alignment, but just because. Yeah. Those are good. <laughs> but perhaps we'll find out more about Addy next time. Who knows? Or maybe not the be, last you've seen of him. Maybe he'll just be Goop. Maybe he'll just be Goop. Maybe we'll just Goop him. Well, considering we didn't kill him, hit we probably him. could have easily taken him down. Hit him with a slime. Who knows? We just we just like throw anti magic. <laughs> Anyway. He's got to die. He's got to go. But who knows? We'll just have to find out. And maybe, I don't know, when when more of uh, episode Mythos comes out, who knows what will happen in there? Maybe we'll figure out what has been going on behind the scenes. What led us to this point? Wondering why the fuck Raven hasn't returned my calls. Well, you haven't called him in like two days. I know. I called him when I got here and he didn't answer. Yeah, but that was two days ago. I could try calling him again. Soon to be three days ago. But... The next episode of uh, the Mythos campaign airs this Monday, episode five. It's going to be a really good one. I'm really excited for this next one. Uh, So I hope you all tune in. Saturday? Uh, Monday. Monday. Monday? Sorry, I burned down an orphanage, but I'm still a good person. (laughs) That's like, like literally. 
Lala's coming for you. That orphanage needed to burn down. The kids were selling crack out of it. That's what they had to do to survive. They were cannibal kids. Oh. All right. Well, we don't know about that. We <laughs> weren't too sure about that. That guy treats me well. But we've been the smoking dragons, and there are 20 sides to every story. Come and be a part of ours. Thank you. Good night. We love you. Stay safe. Until next time, stay tuned for the raid and make sure if you haven't already, join the Discord, subscribe to the YouTube, consider supporting on Patreon so you can watch the super awesome Pocket Adventures. It's really great. We love it. <laughs> is uh, is amazing and we love it. Okay, see you guys later. Bye. 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 He can't stop playing it.